Chim chimney, chim chimney, chim chim cheree. Your mother's a goat and she gives it for free. Chim chimney, chim chimney, chim chim cheroo. Your father's a hamster, your brother is too. Reinforce. Uh, by which I mean, hello, fluffy people of the world. My name is Liquid Blitz, and welcome back to Dark Souls 3. Mm. Mm. And a little bit of Mary Poppins, right? Okay, so we've got some decisions to make at the start of this episode. Um, thank you for your feedback, etc., from last time. Um, as episodes go, uh, I I've... I've received the you missed this sort of comment uh, l the least this time. So I think last episode I didn't miss that much. Um, but thanks for your little tips and things. Somebody made a good point when it came to the crow little boys up the top um, to to test which items they will take. Just try dropping everything because uh, I believe when you drop something, you can just pick it back up again. So just through process of trial and error, I can try dropping anything and everything, and I'll just pick it back up again if they don't want it. So we might make a trip up there post haste and just try dropping everything known to man. Now, I forgot after releasing the last episode, I had 30,000 souls here. Like, I can't remember getting this many souls. It's only been like a few days, but... Yeah, I forgot I got 30,000 souls, which is a bit of an awkward middle ground, because I I want to... Welcome, husky. I want to heal that dog. I don't want to be looking like beef jerky for the rest of the game. As delicious as beef jerky is, I'd rather look fresh and wholesome, so... And have eyeballs. I ain't got no eyes, um, but it costs 60,000, so I'm... I don't want to be running around the cathedral getting slammed by giants. I, I will die and I will lose the souls and I will kick myself. IRL for losing so many souls. So I don't think I'm going to save them. But then I thought, you know what? I've never wasted boss souls before. I'd rather spend them on a weapon now so in the future even in other playthroughs ah, so i would have weapons that i might want then but not now if, if that makes any sense at all so like i would never use a, a sage rapier in this playthrough but I, I might get it so i can use it in a future playthrough but the problem is you only do a blind playthrough one time and i kind of need the souls so i was thinking if there's any boss souls that i i just know in my soul, I will never use that weapon in this playthrough. Why not just fucking use the thing and get the souls from it instead? It, it, it's almost painful to do that, but at the same time, I, f I want to use the stuff I've got in this playthrough, so... You know, I've, uh, please don't hold it against me, but... I, I want to use the tools given to me in this playthrough here and now, so, you know. Is there any boss souls I want to use? In, my, in fact, treat the fire. Souls. I, I might as well pop all the regular soul stuff and, and increase in the in the shit until I get to these two boss souls, and we'll decide what to do. I, I need thirty. I don't know how much a boss soul will give me, but hey. Ah. Right. So. Okay. Right. So, let's just get rid of everything here and now. There's no point saving them up, you know what I mean? 4,000, oh, we're getting up there. Sort of. I'm on 35, oh, come on. Oh, you can see how much the boss souls are worth. Oh, fuck. Oh, God, no. Oh, I thought they would be worth more than that. Shit. Oh, shit. Well, I've, I've committed now. Oh, 6,000? I mean, oh my god. Uh, well, Ashen right. I was thinking, like, uh, I know boss souls in the other games are worth like 10,000 and 20,000, etc. So I was thinking it'd be the same in this one. Why didn't I look first before starting to pop all these souls? Let's make a decision whether the two boss souls I've still got 
I will ever use on the shit. Will I ever want that sorcery? No. Or that for this playthrough? No. I'm happy to use slash sell that soul. So what's the other one? Um, shield splitter sounds interesting, but I'd rather have a club. And as for that, it looks like Lucatil's sword, but I'd rather use Artorius' sword before I use that, so... Okay, choice made. I'm happy to waste those two boss souls. Waste. I mean, I might as well just fucking do it. It feels horrible wasting them. Right, it is 3,000 each, okay. Well, I've done it now. I I've got a choice, to uh, another choice to make. I'm on 49,000. I could just level up and stuff now. I think last time, didn't I make the choice that I was going to wait until I got a lot, like a giant chunk of souls from a boss before committing to that? But I'm so fucking close, I think we're going to risk 50,000 souls by continuing the game with 50k souls on me. Because 10,000 souls ain't much. That's just, that's a good... Decent amount of killing, and I'll I'll have that. I tell you, if I lose these souls, I'll I'll be, I might actually be physically sick and like throw up everywhere. Um, let's go up to your, to your, your feathery bastards. Um, is there a faster way up? Actually. Oh, thanks for letting me know that that's a DLC, so good thing I didn't continue that. Um, I guess not, let's just manually get the fuck up there. Let's jump cut to the rooftop. Every day we're waiting for the world to load. God bless shortcuts. Apparently, some a couple of people said I missed a conversation with Patches. Uh, and I think people were telling me it was the elevator in Firelink. So I'd, I'll quickly pop back up there once we're done with our business here. Maybe I've missed the opportunity, but... Uh... You. Right, so what do we have? I I'm going on the assumption that... I mean, let's just try leaving something completely separately and seeing if it just just simply drop on the floor and you can pick it back up again. Let's not use something valuable, though. You know what I'm saying? Let's just leave a rubbish. Um, uh, right. I think discard officially destroys, doesn't it? Because I don't want to discard something. I just want to leave it and pick it up later. Oh, there's a little sack. Okay. Right, okay. So it is. Let's try let's try leaving everything. Ooh, I, I think I had one guy comment exactly what to leave, but I stopped myself from reading that because it was clearly just a spoilerific. And I'd rather find out for my for myself. Um, Vertebra shackle, that must be a covenant thing. Um, real quick, sorry, um, I noticed something, I was just making sure my inventory was good for this episode, like, 15 minutes ago, I saw that slot there, that diamond slot, I was like, what the fuck? Covenant item. Now, I'm offline, and it's kind of irrelevant, really, um, but I am a, I am a wolf boy, and it says, summoning, read this real quick, pledge oneself to... Blah, 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 blah. The watchdogs ensure that the warriors sleep in serenity by taking the form of loyal spirits and hunting down those who would trespass the woods of Farron. Summoning takes place automatically. Okay, well, let's just shove that in the thing, and hopefully maybe some wolves will just start running around and helping me. <laughs> anyway. Let's try let's throw rubbish down first. I mean you never know. You you Will you take some rubbish? <laughs> no. No. That no pick up pee, that no pump a run. Right, don't want rubbish, gotcha. Okay, I mean, as hilarious as the branches are, I mean, let's just, let's just leave and see if it does anything. Oops, shit. Okay. 
Right, I'm gonna just go through every item here. So I might skip forward for you guys till I find one that it will take. Stop, fuck sake. Right. Let's jump, I'll jump ahead. I'm gonna go through everything and let's just jump ahead until I get one. Correct. Oh, fuck! No, no, no! No! Boy, you piece of shit! I didn't even see the description of what that did. It was... It sound, I, I think it was like something PvP. Uh, was that prevent FP recovery or something? Fuck. Shit. Right, continue the jumping ahead. Fuck. I'll make sure not to use anything again. Bumperum! Bumperum! Hello, carving, or is that one of the things that'll it'll say hello? Huh, alluring skull. Okay. Um. Now I think in the in Dark Souls One, these carvings were just unlimited. It says smash on ground. That's a bit concerning. A strange head of unknown origin, carved from an arch tree. It speaks when thrown on the ground. Have, it, this head says hello, have another look. Do you sense the amicability in its eyes? I do not sense that. That looks fucking horrific. Uh, they were unlimited in Dark Souls 1. Is this just... You! You! Hello! It was interrupted by a f annoying bird, but uh... Is that now gone? No, it's not. Okay, you can just start tossing it everywhere. Hello. I don't really get the point of those, other than a hilarious voice. Is that a way of, like, speaking to other players in PvP land? Interesting. Right, back on the search. Let's just drop another alluring skill and see if it's different, maybe? <coughs> enough, enough. Ah, right, that must be an official way of saying... I've exhausted my alluring skull rewards. I see. There's no way any... There's a, there's a thousand of these, like... Apply shit to your weapon items. None of them are gonna do anything. Let's just leave one. But I doubt it'll... Yeah. It's gotta be items that, like, are useful or, you know... Sort of unique. What is likely to be something? Your pots won't be... Let's leave one pot. Oh, it is! Pop! Pots! Potty pots. Okay. Oh, I wasn't expecting that. Okay. Large titanite shot. Hey, not bad. That's... I'll be able to buy those at some point. Let's try leaving a better one. Oh, yeah. Pump a rum. Chunk. Hey, that's the second best, isn't it? Uh, item. Behind a slab. Okay. Uh... I reckon these will be repeatable. And not just a one-time thing. Oh, maybe not. Okay. I wonder if it's just got, like, one trade for every item that can be traded, if you see what I'm saying. Let's le try and leave a normal one again. No, right, okay. So there's this, like, it was repeatable in Dark Souls 2. Just forever. You would just get the same shit forever. Uh... I guess not in this game. Oh, now, hey, Zigbrow, that's a special item. I reckon that might be a little bit of something. Victory Brew. It's so cool, I'd never use that, so... If this gets you something. Oh, it does! Pumper rum. <gasps> Sunboy Arm! Um. Zigvard of Katarina isn't a sun boy, is he? I thought the onion people and the sun boy people were like nothing to do with each other. Huh. Well, hey. I'm not part of the sun covenant, but uh, I appreciate it. Chainmail armor and white coat featuring a large rendition of the holy symbol of the sun. The choice attire of a singular knight of sunlight from a previous age. Was that the sun boy's armor itself? that I let die in the first game. 
you know, now think about it, it's kind of funny that I didn't go Sun Covenant, because I am on the, fi on the fire slash light side of things. I always go for the fire endings of these games. So it's probably appropriate that I am a member of your Sun Covenant. I'll, but I'll stick with Wolfie for now. Uh, hang on, let's start from the bottom. I mean, let's just try leaving fuck- Oh, you can't. Oh. Hey now, seed of a giant tree, enemies react to invaders. I don't care about that at all. Let's try leaving that seed. Oh, it is! Iron leggings. That doesn't seem particularly special. I wonder if that is repeatable, that one. Chain leggings combined with iron boots. Ah, right, I see. Said to be the leggings of a knight of sunlight. I see. So it's sun, it, it matches the sunlight tunic. I guess you can get the full suns, sun boy set then. Simple as that. Cool. Well, let's keep trying to drop shit. And I... Ooh, okay. Oh, I didn't even know what that was, but just take it. <laughs> Call over. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Hell yeah, I don't even care what the item was. Luca Teal's fucking mask. We got her sword, I believe. Uh, or we got the mirror armor set from the uh, tower outside the Greatwood area. And that was... That was an homage to Luca Teal, but without mentioning her. This actually is her fucking mask. If I can take the weight, that's going on. Like Alderaan. Oh, it's t you can't see it. The weight with this, with the Havel's ring, is 66%. So I'm quite close, but I can afford a little extra weight. Without seeing, guess what the weight ratio is with this? It's 69.6%. So close to fat rolling, but I can wear it. Um, I'm not getting any stats at all from this. I'm just wearing this because it's not fat rolling and I can see my hair and shit. Bruh. Mask attached to a ceremonial hat. A hollow once fought valiantly with this mask. A hollow. She was ho She went hollow in the end. Ah. Okay. But feared the fading of herself and implored a comrade remember her name. I was that fucking comrade. I summoned her for every fight. I completed her quest line, and she was my bay. Okay. Lucatiel was my main NPC friend throughout that whole game. Perhaps this is why this gentleman's mask is named after a woman. You know, shut up, this is not time for you. That actually, you know, I've got a weird head tail. <laughs> but head tail aside, that actually doesn't um, look half bad. It kind of, in a weird way, it sort of matches the set. You know, last episode I was saying I, the, the Fallen Knight set kind of looks like Van Helsing. Well, this hat kind of matches that sort of time period. It kind of matches. I like it. And we're fucking keeping it on since we're not fat rolling. Oh my god. Shut up. Thanks for the hat, but shut up. I had no idea we'd get Luca Teal's fucking hat. What a find. Pale tongue. I think those are... Those are needed for a covenant. Uh... I'm not bothered. I'm not really bothered about covenants. You know, they're, they're mostly there for PvP reasons, and... I'm sure there are some good rewards for some of the Covenant um, when you strengthen the bond, etc. But I'm not overly precious. So I'm happy to just leave all the Covenant items if I get cool shit at the birds. No? Okay. I'll take my pale tongue again. Right. Dark side. Can I get rid of that shit? Nope. Hello, Kai. No. Nope. Binoculars. I mean, I'm picking these up in me. <sighs> No, I'm not gonna- uh, they're too proud. I don't want to fucking give my binoculars. Homeward Bone. I wonder if this is gonna give something. Ooh. 
What is this going to give? Iron Bryce, is that iron? That's more Sunboy shit. Ah, well, we know then there's at least one more item that'll get me the Sun Head Boy thing. The, the, the Sun Boy headpiece. Prism Stone, maybe? Is, ooh, I bet this does give it. <laughs> oh no, Twinkling Titan. That sounds repeatable, though. Let's try leaving another one. No. It's nice that there's only one of everything in this, rather than it being just repeatable forever. Um, and rubbish, and that's it. We've been through everything else. Let's just try leaving Badokas because it's there, but if this gets snapped up by your birds now, I'm going to be upset. <laughs> Thank God, no. Pick them up quick. Right, okay. Then we must get more items then. Because uh, we're missing the Sunboy headpiece. Muy interesante. Right, let's uh, go up and see if... If Patches is up here, as people have said. That rude fuck that kicked me to a pit in your first game. It's just a chain. I mean, maybe I missed him like he'll not be there now. and Or maybe it was like in the cathedral or somewhere and I misread the comments. But pe I'm sure people mentioned the... The jump down place within Firelink. Maybe it's not there anymore. Ah, well. Let's get back to the mission then. I've done your birds. Um, I had no need to do a notepad souls this time, I don't think. But I've done your birds. I've got your 50,000 souls, and I'm not spending them, so... Okay. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Right, let's get back down to the mission, then. Uh, I guess we will indeed just risk the 50k souls and continue the cathedral. It, it's a shit plan, but I was, you know... Honestly, as I was starting the episode, I thought by doing everything I did, I would actually reach 60k souls. But, uh, hey, I didn't. <laughs> I don't think there's anything else needs doing since I'm not spending money. Uh, in terms of leveling up, what comes next will definitely be faith. Um, because I'm a couple short from using lightning and then after I get to that I will then put points into whatever the fuck gives me spell slots because I've only got two which ain't good enough right uh, I'm not going right back to the beginning but I'll start at the chapel I'm going to try my fucking best to not die until I kill a, a bunch of shit Right, that was the shortcut to, uh... I'll remember this. This is the shortcut that will allow me to go back up to... to... Giant Boy quicker. In fact, let's just make sure that is actually correct. It's up there, and then that is... Yeah, back inside and then th just out the archway and you're in the big room with the giant. Yeah, it is. Right, okay. Honestly? I said last time that I would not farm in this game. I didn't in the second game. I did a small bit in the first game, but there was a specific reason for that. But I am patently against farming for souls, straight up. Um, and that still holds true. That said, I might just kill more than I otherwise would in, in this little moment here, the next few minutes, just to help get the 10,000 souls I need, if you get what I'm saying. <laughs> so I'm just going to kill everything I come up against. Hello there! Great, start with a fucking miss. Ooh. Hello well. Here <sighs> Fire bomb. I'm already on 50,000 souls. Bam! Is there an item down there? It usually is. No. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck it. Calm down now. <sighs> Bloody hell, man. Right, just because I don't want to die, I'm going to get back to full health again. Right. 
right, let's keep keep on going. I'm sure somebody in the comments, you know, I've just look, I've just seen a well, and I'm sure somebody in the comments told me that I missed something to do with a well. But hey, I wonder if there's an item there, if there's a lever I can pull or something. Thank you, I will say, for all the spoiler-free comments. I do quite like the, the tip ones. But I couldn't see anything to do with a well there, unless they're on about a different well. Hey, free souls, not gonna complain. Uh, let's get out of here, I don't wanna get wormed. Let's get the bleed things at the ready, there we go. Apparently you can torch the maggots off, which is interesting. Oh, well that's, that's relevant now, because I'm all maggoted up. Fuck you. Um, I don't have the torch equipped, do I? I might want to put it on, because it is really light, and I want to see it in action. I'll put it in the right hand. So I don't accidentally use it in combat. Oh, it just goes off! Right, I don't even have to swing it or anything. Ah. Cool. Uh, once I start... Once I get enough faith to use... Um, Hang on, shit. Actually, I wanted to. I wanted to go back up through the thing again. Shit. Um, well, let's go up. I wanted to go through the the cemetery again. Yeah. Once I get enough faith to start using the lightning spells, because I can't even use the most basic lightning faith thing yet. I do want to start getting multiple slots. It's gonna cost so many souls to get anywhere or get any decent number of faith spells. And I'm going to start steering... That's the point I was going to make. I'm going to start not equipping f healing faithy things, but useful things like this uh, this cure of everything, force, lightning stuff. Uh, and I'm just going to use health pots for healing because, you know, that's what they're there for. And I'd rather have utility and awesome stuff Oh, I'm, I'm fat rolling with your torch. Torch can fuck off. Yeah. So yeah, I, I, I'm not too bothered about healing faithy spells anymore. Since there's so many cool things that I want in, in place of the heals. And I have a more or, or ordinary way of healing anyway, you know? Ow, fuck off. This person's fucking me up. No, don't die now. Don't die now. Don't be doing this to me. Fucking hell, man. What is, what is going on? Fuck. Oh my god, I'm so dead. I'm so... Uh, motherfucker. That just gave me 1,500 souls for that one enemy. Okay. Uh, okay. Well, let's just, you know, let's just fucking clear everything. These come back, but I doubt they give you much souls. Let's see. Oh, 11 each. Right, that, that's not even worth it. Let's go down here. I'm sure I missed a bunch of shit down here, though. Not here, uh, but further back. Charge! I specifically made note of this little ledge here when I ran past it during editing. It's a long path. There's going to be something down here. We'll get back to making progress soon, but uh, I can't be losing these 52k souls. You get what I'm saying? I promise you that me killing all these enemies isn't me farming. I'm just genuinely seeing if I missed anything. So that was just a drop down from the start of this place. Um, I guess I didn't miss anything. I thought I probably did. I guess not. Uh, 
right. No, I, you know what? I'm pretty sure actually I didn't. At least not here. Fuck off. Oh, I'm all wormy again. Let's just go manually back through the place just to make sure that was the plan. Rather than just take this shortcut back to the cathedral. And let's be honest. And killing everything again will be what you call helpful. Okay. Hmm. There's the big fire lady to kill again. That's some good souls. The two, the double grave wardens, because they have such good, uh... Whoa! That, did that person just, like, fucking appear out of the very ether? Like a ghost. Jesus Christ. Okay. Ah, oh, itchy nose. Fuck off! You bastards. Where the fuck is that person, man? Yeah, those grave ones are 1,500 uh, souls apiece, so that's 3k right there. If I can just kill those again without dying. So let's work my way back to them pretty quick. Come at me. The person behind me can't shoot me from where they are. Fuck off, you fast little shit. The only fast little shits I want to deal with are in the comfort of my own lavatory, okay? I don't want to deal with them in Dark Souls. <laughs> right, okay, alright. Fucking hell! Right, I'm gonna fucking die because I suck ass. That's why I'm gonna die. Fuck, just kill him! Good Jesus! My running attack game is weak, man. I suck. You know, I'm so on a, on a, of a, on a very small level, and it is very small because I'm happy with my choice of build in this game. But on a, on some level, I am kind of upset that I decided to go with that sort of a hybrid build. Because, as I've said before, I need points in everything. Every stat, because I need strength, I need lots of faith to be able to use spells. I need a shit load of attunement. I need a fuckload of attunement um, to get the spell slots. Uh, I did have a quick look. I could afford previously to put two points in attunement, and even that wouldn't get me a third spell slot, so I need, like, fucking five levels in attunement per spell slot. Not to mention equip load. And stamina and health. Okay. That's fine, take a hit! Get stand, you fucking ass! Okay, okay. Right, I've been I've been fucked, so I can't heal. That's fine. Let's back off for thirty seconds until I can heal. It's all right. You just stay down there. You you just chill down there. Now I didn't escape my notice that the fucker that was firing upon me from a thousand years ago was from a place that I have not been to yet. And this is like over the chapel. <gasps> oh, in fact. Is that, or is that not, like a back door to the chapel? It must be, because the door that was facing this way, that was still locked, was like right here. That must be it. How the fuck do you get down there? You got, hello there. You've got stairs down there. Ah, oh, there must be like an elevator in that tower. Right, let's go kill your firewoman. 55,000 souls. Long soon. Calm down now. Oh, there you go, there you go. And again, and again. There you go. Right, how many souls for the firewoman? Only 400. Alright. Alright. missed. How many souls? 
400. You see, some of these are worth not farming. Calm down now. Oh, fuck off. Just, 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 just let me take some distance. Let me do a roll slice. And then miss both of them. Let me miss both of them. Let me... Fuck off. You fast, you fast little shits. Fuck, just, just, just... Fucking die. You, you shits. Oh my god, just when I've got the most souls to lose, I suck the most I've ever sucked in this game yet. I'm just getting hit by stuff, I'm missing stuff, I'm hitting walls instead of enemies. I probably have no chance of killing these two grave fuckers. Um, at least if I... Right, hang on, hang on, hang on now. I might be able to pull one at a time, uh, but at least I could shortcut back here easier if I do die. Um, I'm gonna heal my last thing just to make sure I don't die. This this could well fucking get me the 59,000 souls, whatever the fuck I need. Um, well, there's one. I know there's fucking two, so where's the second one? Right, can I just... Uh Where is the second one? Unless only one of them was like a proper... Oh, hang on. Pillar combat. Pillar combat, pillar combat. I can hear it. Just keep going. Keep... Right, that's one dead. No matter what, one is, is dead forever. Right. I was lucky that I didn't pull both. Right, okay. Come on. You fuck. You fuck. Just go for it until he's dead. Until he's in the afterlife. <sighs> 58,000. Oh, I'm so fucking close. Let's just, uh... Fuck you both! 77 souls. Oh, yeah, come on. I'm so close. I could lick the, the ugliness away. I'm so fucking close. Let's just kill everything. Come on. I feel like I'm doing a good thing by asking the fire lady to cleanse my shit. Hang on, back off now, back off now. It's probably breaking um, the dark quest line, if that is a thing. Uh, but you know, I'd rather look nice, honestly. And I'd rather, uh, p this is a personal choice, I'd rather not lean into the dark um, side of things, whether that's a quest line for Yuria and Yul, etc. or not. You know, I, I choose the fire endings for a reason, so if that is a quest line, I won't be partaking in that, probably. Um, that's just my personal choice. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so fucking close. Can I kill that blob monster? Um, I, and I bet I can probably kill that fire lady that's down in the room down bottom as well, and I'll get. I should have made a note of how many souls it is. It's like, it was like 59,400 or something. I'm fucking close. Right, can I just like, is he gonna, he's looking at me, isn't he? Hello there, you fuck. If I could toss some, something at you like a fireball, I would, for fucking slapping me before, you rude shit. Right, Blob can die, that must be a few souls. Surely. And if I've got any souls remaining, I'll, uh... I could... I've got enough scales to, uh... To level up this hammer once. But I'll probably need, like, 1500 souls or something. Dissipate. Thank you. Any souls? Oh. Right, there's like four fucks in this room. Let's just start swinging at motherfuckers.
Oh my god, I must be so close. Right, there's no way Fire Lady Below won't give me enough souls. I'm so fucking close. I think she's down here, isn't she? As is that blob. I, I, I saw you. You blobby shit. I might have enough souls, but she'll definitely put me over the edge. Hello, firewoman! That's right, be gone with you. And your big belly, right? Oh, oh, right, okay, Blob might put me over 60k souls, and then I know for a fact I'll have enough. Come here, you Blob. You are the secret to all my success. You blobby shit. Fucking hell, the lock on camera's a bit zoomed in, ain't it? Jesus. Die! Is that enough? I mean, I couldn't be closer to 60k souls if I tried. Like, literally, I don't think I would get less than three souls from an any single enemy in the game. Maybe some sort of maggot or something. But let's just... Uh... Oh, there's a shortcut here. Let's just take the fucking shortcut. Now she'll take me back down to uh, chapel. I don't want to waste a bone. Having those dark sigils is what turns you more and more hollowed, and I assume the connection is the more hollowed you get, the uglier you get. Um, and that's caused by the dark sigils, is it not? Is it not? And I got those every time Yul gave me a free level and then he died. Being replaced with Yuria, I got five of these. And it, yeah. Do -do -do -do. It says this Dark Sigil will never heal, but there is told of a f t tale told of a Firekeeper who returned from the Abyss. So the Firekeeper, that's why she can cure it. And I wonder if it gets rid of them or whatever. And I will never, maybe that hollowing thing will literally disappear. And I just simply will never go ugly again. But maybe it will... If there's a Yuria Dark questline... And I genuinely don't know if there is or not. Um, but it seems like that might be a thing. Because she's been talking about the dark and all sorts of weird shit. Um, I've avoided reading the spoily comments. Um, I'm a pro at dodging them now. But I've got a feeling doing this is going to be quite a big deal. Like, if there is a quest line, it might end it and break it sort of a thing. Um, but, you know, this is my playthrough. And I, I choose fire and light over dark. I, you know, I'm not such a simpleton that I, you know, a lot of people have, have commented saying, like, they haven't called me a moron, but but they a lot of people are under the assumption that I think dark is evil and fire and light is good. That's not the case at all. I'm fully aware that the dark is just a different choice uh, in these games. It's not good or versus evil at all. It's just interpretation and opinion, etc. Uh, but I still choose the fire and light instead of that. I choose the curse of humanity to keep going. Whether that's against the gods or with the gods is kind of irrelevant. Fire to me it is a place of safety. Like these these literal fire bonfires, it, you know. It really is that simple to me. It's a, it's safe, it's warm, it's fuzzy and comforting. So I choose fire. So Welcome home, speak. I'm getting rid of the dark shit out of my soul. Um yeah. It's done. Pl oh, I'm gonna, I need to take the mask off again to see. Dark Sigil has been healed. I wonder if it can keep continuing then, because it's still there as an option. Farewell, I made the food. Hmm. The, uh, well, what's the deal? Ah, hollowing is completely not even an option now. Uh, did that get rid of the thingies? It did. It did did. Uh, but the option is still there. I wonder if you can get more dark sigils then. Like actual key items from other sources and places in the game. And then I will have to pay to heal those ones as well. 
That kind of makes sense. Welcome home, speak. Makes sense as to why it's still there as an option. Farewell. But next time I die, I'm gonna make... I'm gonna check to see if the hollowing has come back or whatever. Let's take the mask off real quick. Moment of truth. Yeah, I'm beautiful again. Not that it matters because I'm even more beautiful with Luca Teal's motherfucking mask on. Which now, come to think of it, kind of negates the need to look beautiful in the first place, doesn't it? <laughs> I probably won't wear this mask for the rest of the game, though. I do actually secretly... It's not secret anymore. I do prefer seeing my face and hair. Especially the hair. Because I like having luscious locks. Um, so I will take the mask off at some point, but I'm going to keep the mask on at least for this episode. If not more. But let's start the episode fucking proper. I've got 560 souls. Is that enough to bump up my club by one level? Probably ah, not. I bet I need like 1500. No, nope. 2400. Right. Okay, well, we'll just keep going. Pretty beacon. So far, the only the only dragon scales which are needed for the boss weapons to upgrade have only come from big crystal lizards and they seem few and far between. Like, seriously. Um. Da -da 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 -da. Right, let's take the shortcut back to giant. And I might try dodging his hand and then hitting it. See if I can kill his hand. And yeah, that's the door. That must be the door that I saw. But yeah, either you get another source of dragon scales or, or whatever it is. Or there's a lot more crystal lizards later on in the game, because, yeah, there's, I've seen, like, what, three in the whole game so far? Um, right, here we go. Let's just keep going. Hello, you handy fuck. Oh, he's sleeping. Can I, like, sneak? No, no, you can't. Oh, he did, right, he got rid of the pillar for me. Can you get rid of more pillars, please? Okay, that's my bad. Uh. Oh, fucking right, he's got a swipe. Okay, that's fine. I think his hand always retracts too fast for me to hit, doesn't it? Let's see. Yeah, I know his hand is gone. I can't, like, right, okay, yeah. All right. Mm-hmm. You missed. Oh, we've got boxes. Hang on now. Can I, uh... Is this... Oh! Right, I can't see because the camera is all up in my fucking face like a bitch, but but did he try and grab me around the... Oh! <laughs> he fucking force pushed me. Right, okay, he's hitting me and I'm touching the wall, so I've just got to go for this. Uh, but I would- I do want the loot and shit, though. Lloyd's- I'll remember them. Lloyd- Lloyd's sword ring. Lloyd's sword ring. Fucking hell, that's fast as shit, boy! Right, he's got to change his attack style to get you around the corner. I understand. So he's, there's a split second where you are kind of safe. This is ridiculous, bruh. At least I ain't got no, got no souls to lose. Oh, you can time it. You can time the roll. Let's just... Let's practice. Let's practice. Fuck you. Right, no, I officially, my shit went through his shit there. You missed. Right. You can't hit his hand, it's like see-through. You missed, you didn't miss at all. I'm just pretending you missed. Right. Let's just make sure I ain't nothing, nothing else here. Any items? No, there's nothing, there's nothing at all. Right, let's go, fuck. 
Good Jesus in heaven. Any blobs? I'm smelling blobs. Good Jesus. I'm pretty sure I swiped through his hands there, so... So I don't think you can kill his hands. Right, what the fuck was that ring? I'm making a choice here that I, for now, I need the equip load from that ring. So I need that. I'm always going to keep the stamina ring on. Uh, I'm going to have one defensive ring on only at any one time. So poison bleed, etc. Or physical defense. So I'm going to have that one ring reserved for defense. And then that gives me the, the soul one, I guess, for utility and switching out for any unique shit. Uh, boost attack when HP is full. Ring given to Knights of the Way of White. Depicts all Father Lloyd's sword, sword of lore. Didn't I have one already mentioning the Way of White? And it was the opposite. It was low HP or something. I guess not. I remember reading something about the Way of White, but it was probably a weapon or something. But, uh, honestly, I'm not on full health so much of the time. <laughs> that just seems like a bit of a waste. You know what I mean? Alright, that'll go back up to the room I just left. Mm, this, is, this is like an antechamber. Like a big room off from the side of the, uh... Ah, you fell, you bitch! You fell like a bitch! Hang on now, what's going on here? We got a blob. I, I I I see the blob. I'm not a basic bitch. I'm an advanced bitch. <laughs> my experience in Dark Souls so far has risen my skill level. I've been promoted from basic bitch to advanced bitch, and soon enough I'll be expert bitch. Seek guidance. Reveal more help and signs without using Ember. Miracle Stray Souls. Display more help from other worlds and reveal summon signs without using Ember. Ah, so you need to be Embered to see friendly summon signs. Alright, it's irrelevant to me, but that's cool. Right, the choice is jump down. Is there a bonfire anywhere? I mean, I'll survive the jump. I'll go up first. Always go the direction of no return. Last. So I'll go up first. But I'll remember we've got a place to go. Woo! Gee, I thought that was a dangling boss there. I got flashbacks of Elden Ring. Those big dangly fucking... Fucks. <laughs> Keep swinging for days until I stumble a woman. Ow, she fucked me. Oh, I'm fucked. I stand here before you now, truly unafraid and fucked. I've got two flasks left. Well, this must be a boss, even if it's kind of a mini boss. I need a bonfire, man. Or a shortcut. Giant is not stirring yet. That's good. Now, does this drop down to that fuckhead? It does. So this is just irrelevant. And just a shortcut back, I guess. Hang on. It does seem weird that there'd be no reason to come this way at all. Just the ember, I guess. Right, well, we'll jump down then. Now that's a fucking chandelier, ladies and gentlemen. Ah, oh, there's a doorway up there. I bet we go up in the rafters at some point. Cool, let's jump down. Oh, hang on now. Uh, you can never be too careful. 
Oh, well, I went on Yuki Ball. Oh, 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 that was so much fall damage. <laughs> you shit. God damn, right. What's the safest direction to fall? There must be like a... Honestly, I'm going to take so much fall damage here. Um, I'm going to need to use my last thing. This seems like a... The, right, I can probably fall into those things there because they don't get destroyed. Mm. Yeah, hang on. Right. Oh, do you reckon I can sort of hit the... Ah, that's, that's, that's a better place to fall. Any illusory walls? I thought I, I, thought I heard an illusory wall sound then. Placebo. Right. Well... You know, sometimes you gotta take the bull by the dick. Oh, that wasn't much at all. That was good. I can hear a big thing moving. Oh, it's just your it's your box standard big old night fucker. I'm not scared of these guys. Especially if they <gasps> Oh, I really thought I had a I did a I thought I got a backstab, and then he was just looking in my face. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, I wanted to lower his shield. Oh, you, you got poised fucked, sir. Oh, just a basic bitch. Posing as a, as a tough bitch. Understood. Right, can I see a bonfire anywhere? For the love of God. We've got stairs, we've got... Fucking... I don't want to trigger a boss fire or anything. Good Jesus. Hang on, that's just... Oh, that looks like some sort of gauntlet room. Just hang on. <sighs> we've got two stairs. And we've got some little fuckers. Oh, why do I suck ass? Wasn't there another one? Where is he? Yeah, I can, I can hear his fucking... Hi. Fuck, who? Are you kidding me? Are you, like... Fucking die? You little wretch. Right, well, this is, let's commit to a stairs, for fuck's sake. God damn. Well, we've got a chest that's going to kill me. How is there not a fireplace yet? <gasps> it's just a sound. It's just a, just a friendly sound. Right, chain... Right, ch I remember. Chain going backwards was not a mimic. So this is a mimic. It, it's just... It just is. So... I'll commit to a mimic fight later, but it, it'll just kill me and and just laugh at me. So, come on, shortcut or bonfire. Hello, giant. I see you. Are you kidding me? What is what is wrong with me and my stupid sense of direction? I could have just gone down the stairs, but no. I'm looking for the best way to fall down and take fall damage. I am such a piece of shit. I'm shit. Oh my god. Right, let's, let's go up these stairs then. I really am shit, you know. I think that's the answer to all my issues and problems. I'm just shit. My sense of direction is shitter than I thought. My skills are less than I thought. My ability to... S oh, for fuck's sake. Long finger Kirk. Can suck my long cock. Long finger Kirk, nice to meet you. My name is Long Cock Fluffy. What's in here? You can fuck off. Let's go somewhere else instead. Let's grab this. So even if I die, I've got a thing. Ember. Right, okay, good. Hello. 
Hello, you giant cat monster spider. Nice to meet you. My name is Longcock Fluffy. Now, you, I know for a fact this little boy is too big to fit through this doorway. Surely. Surely he can't, like, squeeze in like an octopus. You can't catch me. <laughs> what is this? It's not a boss. Oh! Oh! Calm down now. Let, for the first time, let's just use a force spell and see. Oh! I've got no health, man. The last bonfire I was at was in the fucking chat room. Oh, that's right. Fuck off. This is not time for you. It's time for you. Goodbye. What is this? It's like a dog mixed with a spider, mixed with a cat. Oh, it's just a spider, isn't it? Let's be honest. A spider with, like... Like... Dog legs. Hello! Force! Yeah, that's really cool and fast, actually. That force spell, that was fast as shit. Fuck off, man! Oh, I've got an invader on one side wanting my guts for garters, and I've got a spider trying to s just breathe on me. Fuck off. Oh my god. I mean, just, just, you know. Fuck. I'm dead. I'm, I'm so dead. I, he's just dancing. Look at him. Trying to have me. Fuck off. In the face! That's what happens to you, you you spider dog. Fuck off. Oh, seriously. Seriously. Right, th this li Right, hang on. Wh where's the threshold that he... I think it's like here, the threshold, where he is losing interest. I can't get too far out of this doorway. If he can do the big jump, that'd be great, because he's... It's a bit shit. Jump up. Do you do you jump? Jump. Ah, oh, he knows when to jump back, doesn't he? Oh! Oh, now, now. I've never been caught between a rock and an hard place more than now. No health, no flasks. Spider dog or fucking invader. I don't consider this cheesing, by the way. I consider this smart tactical usage of a corridor. He's always oh, coming. He's coming. He's fucking coming. That's what she said. I don't know what that will be. That doesn't look poisonous to me. Maybe that's corrosive breath. Seriously. <laughs> the, the range of some of these attacks is... It's hard to gauge because he's swiping with his legs on some of these attacks. Now that that leg will officially be going through the doorway. So if I get closer, it will hit me. I wasn't born yesterday. I can't, I can't fuck off, man. Oh, I wish I had a heal spell. <laughs> huh. I mean, for fuck's sake. Right, hang on, hang on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, for fuck's sake. I'm sorry this has taken so long. This is, this is probably frustrating to watch and boring. I just, you know, there. No! All that, all that time. All that time and effort and everything just to die. <sighs> well, right, at least I've, I've, I've got no souls to lose here. Ah, oh, oh now. Hey now. Uh, hollowing situation. Right, I'm not hollow, so I know I'll be, I can see skin under there. So I'm, right, so I'm just not going hollow. An extra little point, I'm not Embered anymore, and I've got a little wolf head for a symbol. 
Cool. I'm not going to bother embering. Um. In fact, the ember situation. Uh. Um. Now that I'm not embered, that will that yellow fuckhead. What's his name? Yellow finger. Whatever. Will he not invade now? Because I'm not embered. That'll be a weight off my shoulders. What was his name? Yellow finger? What? Or was it not Yellow finger? Was that? I'm, th I'm thinking of Hazel. No, she was called Yellow finger Hazel. I don't know if this is the easy way around, but let's just run for days. You suck, sir. I wonder if you can survive that fall. You probably can. It's not that... It's not that far down, actually. Oh, dude, you suck. That giant is so slow. Uh, you know what? I am half tempted to ember, actually. I've got plenty of embers while I'm here. Hello! Surprise! You suck. I can't believe the first mimic in this game killed me about six times. Deep Braille Divine Tome. Hey now. Learn miracles of the deep. Now, deep gems give you dark on your weapon, so I'm, I bet this is more dark spells. Which I wasn't bothered about at all. Give this to a storyteller to learn miracles of the deep. Intended to teach divine protection to the deacons of the deep, but later, dark tales were added to its paint house. Such a it is now considered a thing profane. I bet once I give that to uh, Irina, she's she mentions the the feeling of the dark and shit again. Well, I'm not bothered about dark. Now is that- yeah, ooh, this guy's farmable, as it were. Come at me, bitch. You ain't shit. In fact, this guy is- ooh. Fuck off. Oh my god. Right, I'm gonna ember. Uh, yeah, fuck it. I can kill this fucking thing. I want the health. Oh, the wolf head is still there in the icon, but it's, it's covered in amber. I didn't see it before. Uh, and nice to note, it, it heals your fall as well. That's a nice little bonus. I was about to waste a healing flask. Right. He's above me. Let's get in the room with him so I'm not a bitch. I bet I can probably kill him. I, like, hit him before he gets ready as well. There. There. Oh, my God. Oh, if I aim that last attack at him... I mean, look how easy that- Oh shit, is that curse build-up? Hmm. I haven't been cursed yet in this game. What the fuck was that? Poison deep crystal rod. No. Was it a key? No. A spell? What the fuck did I just get? Oh my god. Um... Let me, ladies and gentlemen, let me know in the comments what the fuck I just got. It, it happened so fast, I, I missed it. Like a piece of shit. I, my game just flickered there. That was weird. So is this just like a fucking nothing room? I came in that doorway, there was the big spider. Did he drop something really important? Um, fuck me. I might have to watch my own episode back or just wait for your feedback. I don't know what I just looted, but this is a big sort of special looking room and there's nothing else in here, which leads me to believe the item I just got might actually be really important. Um, oh, I need to pay more attention. Well, let's keep going. Very, very strange, but let's keep going. Let's kill this fuckhead, actually. Since I'm embered again. Oh, we're on the uh, the giant level. Right, am I going to get invaded? Where is he? There he is. 
Right, I'll fight him. There he is. Come at me, motherfucker. I'll fight him down here. Where it's safe to do so. Let's go. Let's make some space. Right, where are you? Bring your pretty face to my club, bitch. Come at me. Stop being a shit. Use all my stamina. And he's just nothing. Long finger Kirk. Ah, well they've all got finger in the name I'm noticing. Hang on, fuck, there's too much on the screen. Spiked shield, barbed straight sword. Barbed, spiked, barbed, spiked. Barbed, spiked. Barbed and spiked, barbed and barbed. Barbed straight sword, a sword of long finger Kirk, the infamous knight of thorns. He was a bit of a basic bitch. This sword's blade is lined with countless deadly thorns. The thorns of the ominous weapon induce heavy bleeding. Mm. Muy interesante. Look at that fucking shield. I did think he looked a bit spiky. Long finger, so there's yellow finger Hazel and long finger Kirk. I wonder what the, the finger part of their names means. The notorious knight of thorns. Bristle with thorns. Its de vicious design makes it an effective weapon, and its thorns can inflict heavy bleeding. Right? It's, so it's literally, it's literally thorns, the ability thorns from World of Warcraft, that drew its cast, and when you get hit, they take damage. It's literally that. That's very interesting. There's no way it's going to have 100% physical reduction. Nah. That would make it way overpowered. Interesting. I missed Executioner's Greatsword last episode as well. Somebody said to read it. There. We got that in the graveyard with all the maggoty shits. Greatsword of a debauched Executioner used for beheadings. Huh. I'm thinking of Ned Stark being decapitated. This sword retains a keep, a, a keep a keen memory of its Executioner's duty and absorbs FP from each fallen foe. Skill stomp. That's new. Use one's way to lunge forward with a low stance and increased poise and follow with a strong attack. Cool. Oh, that's that's like an interesting hybrid weapon because great sword, but you're getting FP. If I didn't have such an awesome club or like, uh, you know, Artorius's sword, that might actually be a, a weapon I, might, I would otherwise use because that's very particular to a to a hybrid build is that well, let's go around the sideways first before we commit to hitting a giant in the foot okay I didn't see what that was but let's just kill the little fuck first what the fuck uh right What's going on here? Is that the statue doing something or something else? Alright, I don't know what's going on. But that's clear, clearly corrosive or something. Right, um, hang on now. I, I can't even see, but just kill it. Let's just have a quick check very fast. Oh. What the fuck is the dinging, ringing walking sound I can hear? Ah! Oh, it must be somebody right above me. Let's see if there's a build-up of something. There is not, but you're very, very, very slow. And I still ain't got no rusted iron ring, so... You, you come into some serious slowage. Oh, it's just water. Oh, yeah, hang on. What's the slowdown? Right, so you're not slowed down in shallow water. Can I release the water to clean the shit? No, the shit is taller than the clean water. Oh. Bloody hell, look at this fucking room, man. This is gorgeous. 
Oh, okay. We, we, he's got a twin brother over yonder. Oh my god. Right. Let's k kill the little fox. There's an armor guy over here. Let's kill the armor guy. Where are you? Oh god. Oh, for fu I really hate the way they backstep. Fuck off and die. Oh, I thought I killed him. The fuck? Uh, right, we've got a little lever lever. We've got a lever lever. Ow, you fuck! Dude, nice shield. That's a dragon emblem on the shield, ain't it? Oh, fuck, man. Oh, just... Oh, my God. Right. Have I learned nothing in my previous episodes? I need to properly manage... Oh, God, everything. I need to... I need to manage everything. Most of all, I need to manage my levels of suckage. I can't even see, man! I'm stuck between a, 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 an armoured boy's dick and a fucking statue that's spewing shit on me. Enough! You suck! Almost as much as me. Jesus Christ, I've got shit spewing my face this way, I've got armoured dick the other way, then a small guy trying to poke me and proc me and jump back and s s oh. Fuck. Right, I've got purple, that's poison, is it not? Was I wrong? Will this give me poison, brother, if I just sit in it? Cause that, why is he getting poisoned and shit? I wonder if he was spewed upon by the statue. And that is poison. Uh, well, I'm not getting bleed anymore after leaving the cemetery. So, let's put the poison ring on. That must help quite a lot. Right, fuck. What else is over here? And what the fuck is that lever? Hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ah, that's just showing me that I've got poison resist. Okay. Jesus Christ. I tell you, proper little, little fucking basic bitches literally are the toughest people in these games. For s Seriously. The bigger, the bigger enemies are actually all easy as shit. Oh, hang on, we've got clean water yonder, but poison there. I wonder if the giants are causing water to get all fucked. And if you kill the giants, it turns into nice little clear water. If I can get him to leave the shit and enter this side, I can fight at full speed. Um, wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. Wake up, bitch. Actually, hang on. Fuck. I want to see what that thing does first. It might be an elevator or whatever. We need a proper wave of water to wash away the filth. That's what we need. Oh! -ho! Holy camera, Batman. Right, okay. Uh, that's, that, that's cut off one half. Can I... Is that... Hang on, can I walk through the, the gap? I can, right, so that's just blocking him. That's the entrance that we came in at up there. Um, can I undo that? Yeah, I can, right, so I can undo that. Noted. Oh, fuck. Alright, let's go down here. I'm guessing this will go into this half. Yeah. Alright. Okay. Oh, hang on. Did I get a ring from that spider dog? I don't think I looked at rings, did I? Did I? No, I didn't get a ring. Well, I can I can segregate the two giants. What's the point in that? It's got to have some sort of. I know what door that is. That's the door that. 
down from there is the first Grave Warden and, like, the area outside where Fucker was sniping. That's that doorway. Can I sneak past this guy or am I just fucked? I've got 16 K souls I'd rather not lose. Let's just be a sneaky... Fuck. Okay, I mean, I, f I feel... I feel strongly like you could just roll to the door and open it. But, uh... We'll get the shortcut later. What's more important is traversing more of the cathedral. Fuck off. We can segregate them. But we can... But we can walk through it. There's gonna be some extra significance to that. We're not blocking ourselves, only the giant. Is there some reason you need to segregate the two giants from each other? I wonder if there's another one, like, up here, above our heads, if there's another one. I don't think so. Jesus fucking Christ. In fact, there's easier ways of doing this. Uh, that doesn't zoo- it, it's a bit less mind-fucky to look through the binoculars. Right, no, there isn't, is there, so... I thought there might be an, a, a section and a section leaving a middle clean water section. I'll leave it down. And uh, I'll see about getting this guy out of the out of the shit and into the into the nice water, so I can fight him at faster speeds. Honestly, I'm less scared of this big fuck. Oh! Uh, no. I mean, is there some relevance to this thing? Can I can I get him over here? Oh no. All right. Is that a shrouded person? Hmm. Well, there is, a, there is a place we can go before I actually try and kill this fucker, and I will try and kill him. If I can get him on, at least on the edge of the shit. But until then, let's quickly see where we can go up here. There's got to be a bonfire soon. It's, it's, it's getting silly, <laughs> you know what I mean? It's getting silly. Oh, hang on, I'm smelling an outside shortcut door that goes back to chapel. Stop breathing in so hard because I'm getting really dizzy here. Oxygen overload. Jesus Christ. Let's, uh... Right. It's true what they say. They give you oxygen on planes to make you high. Because... Jesus Christ. Okay, don't ever breathe in that hard that quickly. Fucking hell. I'm legitimately woozy. Jesus. Christ alive. Okay. Uh, I feel tingly and fucking weird after that. I've never bre breathed in that hard so quickly before. Fuck me. Um. Uh, what the fuck? Uh, right. Required souls is only 10k. Let's, uh. How many I souls items have I got? Not enough. I'll, uh. Oh, fuck it. I'll level up. I don't give a fuck. Real quick. Let's just. I'll jump cut back. Level up and jump up back again. I'm just gonna get to 20 faith, so let's go. And not only will 20 faith let me use the lightning spell, I'm gonna put that on at the cost of anything else. I'll replace force, like I don't care about spell slots as much as getting the lightning spell, because that will be a ranged ability. Which, like, it was the one strength I was thinking of with the fireballs, like having a fireball equipped, I've got some range I can use, that is negated with the lightning bolt. Welcome, her speak. Then I'll never need fire or dark ever, you know? Very well, then he So let's get to... I need four levels, but I, I, you know... 
Let's put the money where the mouth is. I did say this was a strength and faith playthrough, and that requires high levels of faith to use all the spells. So, and while we're here, real quick, um, let's hand your deep braille motherfucker to Irina. Oh, right, there's no way this d isn't dark spells, so let's just make a note of what we've got. We've got Blade, Silence, and Dead again. Have a pleasant journey, champion of I pray for So let's see what we oh, get. Champ, do you wish it's gonna be three more dark ones, ain't it? Oh, champion of Ash, this device are dark tales of things that lurk deep within men. This is a repeat of the other dark Sorry, one. It would not please you. Of course, only right. little creatures that nibble at me in the darkness. We, we've got nibbling again. It's it's the same exact voice line when we gave her the other one from uh, Dark Queen over there. Okay, so we had Blade, Science, did it again. I wonder if every new thing just gets added to the end of the list. Now I've got Deep Protection, some extra attack, absorption, resist, stamina recovery. That sounds fucking quite useful. <laughs> Miracle taught to inaugurated deacons of the Cathedral of the Deep. Slightly boost attack, but slightly. Slightly boost attack, damage absorption, and resistance. While also increasing stamina recovery speed. Probably doesn't last long, I'm guessing 10, 20, or 30 seconds. And I reckon slightly means slightly, like a very small amount. Otherwise, I'd be way too overpowered. Became the final rest for many abhorrent things. So the deep is a place. It was originally a peaceful and sacred place. Is that what the abyss is now? Is it, is it the same place? Ulus Seal? It was once called. The, the names do change between these games because of the lengths of time. Hmm. Anyway, that's some small boost to everything for a short time. Summon an insect swarm to feast on foes. Now that's dark right there. It's gotta be. Dark, and there you go, Dark Miracle. Oh, that one doesn't say Dark. Hang on. Uh, no, they don't all say Dark Miracle, but they are clearly Dark Miracles. Another Cathedral of the Deep. Da, 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 da. These insects will lurk in the deep. Which lurk in the deep have tiny jaws lined with fangs. Dark, dark is definitely more evil sounding than the fire and the light. Just, you know, little nibbling bastards. Doesn't sound pleasant. All right. Have a pleasant journey, champ. I pray for your... I am curious what bleed builds are like in this game, because... From what I've heard or understand, bleed builds in Elden Ring are... Not just some of the most powerful builds, but literally are the most powerful builds. Are they not? Like, the whole Rivers of Blood thing, even after a bunch of nerfs and shit, isn't that still the fucking gold standard for overpowered builds? But in the... Dark Souls series. I don't think they're as strong. Uh, well, is good, wasn't it? Right. I'm loving this uh, club, sir. Can you make it better for me? Now I've got the souls. Yeah! Right, it's going up by about 40 damage. Pretty be careful. <laughs> Pretty will be careful. Thank you, sir. Let's get back to it with a stronger thing. And let's keep going. Hoping next big boss, which should be soon, I hope, will uh, give me enough souls to finally get to 20 strength. We've seen several miracles now that require specifically 20 strength. Uh, faith. Uh, real quick. It might be 18, actually, for the lightning, not 20. What is it? Please, please be 18. Oh, it's 20, yeah. All right, we'll get there. We're gonna prioritize that over all else. All of the leveling will uh, take a back seat for now. This is new, where's this go? How long have we been going? Hour 40 minutes. Oh, we're gonna... We've got an elevator. Well, let's go up it. Uh, I might... Uh, hmm. 
I'll see what what's around the vicinity, but I might go back down. Oh! Back down to the cathedral first. That kind of looked a, a bit like a dead end down in there. Because I couldn't see a way up onto the end of the cathedral, if you see what I'm saying. Uh, and I wouldn't be surprised if, like, we've come up and we did see there was places to go in the rafters in that big room. I reckon that's how you get to the other side, past the giants. That's, uh, yeah. Oh, hang on, this is, a. Uh, is this not shortcut? I've got a fucking ladder. That's where... That's the door right in there, is it not? Um, yeah. That's the double blue doors that I thought was behind the giant. Surely... Oh, I must have been wrong then, because that is down, down below. That's down, down, down. But this is way higher, so it must have been a different double doors. And that's, yeah, okay. Well, let's just climb the ladders and see where we go. Let's commit to something for once. The one thing I struggle with the fucking most in life is, uh, is being indecisive, so... I, I missed on purpose there, in case it was an NPC. And I'm glad I did miss. I'm fucking glad I did miss. I swear I genuinely meant to miss on that uh, just in case it turned out to be an NPC. What is going on here? He's not a uh, friendly, like, talking to me NPC, but he's not trying to kill me either. We've got a big old bell. That's what she said. Brackets, I wish. Hmm. Anyway. Enough lamentation at Tiny Cockdom. Where the fuck is this going? We've got a higher raised bridge. Right, this might have been one of the bridges I... <gasps> what the fuck? What the fuck? God snipers are these pieces of shit. It's clearly going up higher, and I reckon these are arches that go into the rooftop of the inside of the cathedral that I made note of previously. This is definitely going up in there. It is. So. I'm not going to kill this guy. This is the weirdest thing that's happened in the game yet. What the fuck? I wonder if I was hollow. Would you be able to speak to him or something? Or... He's got a... A chime. I'm not going to kill him. Maybe he'll ring the bell for me and do me a solid later or something. Uh, and that is just a shortcut back to me. Oh, fuck it. Let's keep going. It's fine. Let's just keep going. And we'll, uh... We'll make note that there is more to explore with your two big giants down there. I didn't check it all out. There was even items to loot right there, you know? Okay. I think a run and a... Just a run off the edge will do this. For professional... Oh, that's a lower down chunk of shit. Oh, it's the elevator. Right. Okay. Well, let's, uh... Let's see if I'm right. Hello, you... M <laughs> that's my hubris right there. I was about to say you missed. You so didn't miss that my ass is dead. And an ember is wasted. What the fuck? All of the... <laughs> oh, the concatenation of distant fucking accurate sniper fire arrow firing fuckheads. And a super slow swinging piece of shit made me dead. I'm going ember. I I'm, I'm not standing for this shit no more. I'm not. Rest of the episode, professional. I'm not dying again, unless there's a boss. In fact, I should have even more balls than that. I'm not dying even if there is a boss. It's time for big balls. And even bigger actions. Actions speak louder than words. 
Well, that includes not dying. Oh, oh, I nearly swung again. <laughs> you just keep chilling. I like to think we're doing a good thing by not killing him. It's too... It can't be a... Right, let's kill the arrow fucker. Fuck off. Fuck... Like, like, for cereal. Fuck off. Fuck you. Jesus Christ, these pesky shits. Either that is an NPC and we don't have the the conditions... Uh, oh, this isn't an illusory wall. Okay. Just a closet for that fuckhead to hide in, gotcha. Either we don't have the um, conditions met to speak to that NPC, or... or something. It can't be a bug that he doesn't attack, you know what I mean? Surely. It looks like a mob, though. All right, hang on. There we go. There we go. We've got something there. Let's go down to the end first. Let's roll at every one of these. Right, come at me. Fuck off with your massive 60-foot halberd and I don't have the range. My club is just as long as yours. Oh, I've got another one. Right, okay. Multiple inlets. Run away! Something shooting me. Ah, oh, bless. We've already got one of those. That's fine. Okay. Hmm. Ah! Fucking Jesus! That's right, bitch! That's what you get! Bitch. That's right. How's he alive still? He just fell like 60 feet. Tough motherfuckers. Right, so we've got two ways in so far in the middle. Oh, I can hear one of the armored fuckheads. Ooh, a pale tongue. Oh, fuck off. Fuck off, man! Jesus Christ in heaven. Yeah, tough, pesky. I want to use a stronger word, but kids might be watching. Rhymes with punts. Let, let's punt these edge. Let, let's punt these punts off the edge with a well-placed kick. Right, let's get inside. Okay. Can we, uh, can we drop a chandelier on a motherfucker, maybe? Be an interesting way to kill the giants. Oh, for the love of God, Jesus, right, hang on. Oh my God. I was right about the rafters. Now, where's that? I can hear the walking armor guy somewhere. Right, this is not the place to be fucking around with these spindly fucks. But well, I'll guard. Hang on, I'll guard. I need him to come around to me. There we go. There we go. Oh, fuck. I didn't mean to. Just, just, just. This is not the place to be fucking around. Like rolling around. I'll take a hit before I roll. Stop rolling. Oh, Jesus. Right, so we are over the fuckhead. You know, I was just bullshitting, but I can properly see that being a... a tactic. We've even got, like, a big old gate we've raised to, like, stop them traversing too far away. I wonder if we can, like, get them walking and talking and moving and shit. And then... Well, then we can time, like, a fall of your chandelier on his head. I mean... You know. Big old chandelier, big old giant. I'll be shocked if that's not some sort of solution to, uh, to killing him. And they're trying to fucking swap me, so... 
they can just die. Even if one of them is like a friendly giant or whatever, they can fuck off and die. Right, come at me. This guy's like the pursuer. Uh, he's even got the pursuer move set. That stab was very pursuer like. Fuck off, man. Oh. This, this was like budget pursuer. A very pursuous uh, looking sword and a very pursuer looking attack. And now the rains weep over his halls because he's a dead bitch. Oh, this was a dead end. Okay. Alright, any. There's not like the dipping illusory wall. No. Okay. Well, let's keep going. If I can get one of these to jump off the edge. Or whatever. Be much appreciated. Whew. Are these guys up here? Yeah, they are. Right, uh... Can I get him to fucking jump off the edge? <gasps> okay, these guys travel faster than you think they're gonna travel. You feel me? He was just on my ass. Right, is he not gonna follow... Oh, oh, oh. I, th I thought you might be able to get looking, kind of cheese them off the edge. You stupid fuck. Hey, let's do that to let's do that to all of them. Fall down and make my life easier. Right, come at me. Oh, this one's got a. Uh, it can shoot. You missed. I'm going by sound. I'm waiting for him to shoot. Right, come at me. I'm, going, I'm, just, I'm basing everything on sound here. Right, I don't know how the other one fell either. The falling was weird. That's just a runaway. Maybe he'll start back stepping. I don't know how the other one fell off, if I'm honest. Because I can't, I didn't see, and I don't really. They're not doing anything movement-wise that looks like they would accidentally like step off. Surely. <sighs> oh, is there? No, no, is there, is there still? Yeah, their movement isn't like. There's nothing that would step them off the edge to to break their pathfinding. So I don't know how the first one died, but fine, whatever. As long as that guy's back there, I don't give a fuck. They're not strong enough for me to be worth killing. Okay, so we've reached the end. There's nothing else up here other than killing these guys and then the chandeliers. Huh. There was a bit of loot up here and shit, but otherwise... No, it's coming. Uh, okay, well, that's just another way in. Hmm. There are, hang on, there are places to like, f like down up, up on that thing there, that ledge. There's, you could easily survive that fall down to there. <laughs> just run in circles as I'm checking the vicinity out. We could probably survive a fall onto the actual gate itself. And I'm wondering now, if the gate was raised, it would be way higher up, wouldn't it? Would that be like a pathway? Oh, the, the, oh this guy's like catching me up. <laughs> yeah, this would be way higher up to... Uh, it might even be like in line with this that, that platform down there. But that would make a bridge between there and... He fell off! <laughs> right, okay, you can just run away until they die. I can't loot them, sadly. Unless their bodies are, like, down there. But... But fuck them. But that bridge would raise up here, it in line with kind of nothing on that side. Um... 
it would just line up with kind of nothing, really. But on that side, you'd have that platform over there. I'm sure it would pro almost, almost certainly raise up to join the edge of that platform there. Hmm. Otherwise, I still don't know what the fuck the point of raising the platform was. Let's just check out the vicinity. I couldn't see any obvious way up to the end of the cathedral. You got a giant boy, you got worms on the thing, you got an area up and over there. A couple of gazebo looking raised bits. Uh, oh, no, I'm getting a bit confused. Like, that. Oh, you see, there are other places. Are there not? Like, all that area down there that goes around up there, probably. I haven't been there, surely. Although, you know what? Uh, now I'm looking at where that gate is. Did that come out of the out of the ground, or did it raise from the ceiling? Because because that gate looks visibly trapped under those brown stairs there. Do you see what I mean? It's underneath the stairs, so it can't go up unless the stairs is part of the gate. Oh. Huh. But I could I could literally jump and survive the fall to that. I'm tempted to, since I'm up here already, I'm not going to go all the way back down again. I don't have any souls I give a fuck about, but all this area on the sides is, uh... Oh, hang on, that, that giant is now standing up. Is that relevant? He's stood up now. He's looking at me, isn't he? He's following me. Have I got his interest now? Like, for some relevant reason. He's like, he's eyeing me up for my for my change. I think he wants to mug me. I should have paid him more attention, you know, to the gate because I thought it lowered from the ceiling, but I, I guess it must have. Raised from the floor. Oh my god. Look. The top of this gate has a has that sort of rectangle with the cross on it. That chunk of floor over there where I where I said that that looked like it could probably be a gate as well. That's got the same thing in the center. That is a fucking gate, and it did come from the floor. It fucking did. So that I, I it looks like you can raise two gates and be safe from both giants. But what's the fucking point in any of that? Um, let's jump down here. You know what I mean? You can survive the fall, so why wouldn't you? You know what I mean? Let's heal, let's just use what I've got. I mean, since raising it, that is a pathway. It just doesn't seem to go anywhere. That's the problem. It, it just goes to the edge. There's nowhere to jump from there. I mean, fuck. Let's just keep jumping down. I, mm, it's hard to tell where I've been. There's a ladder there. Uh... And that came up from the room where the invader was fighting me, if you see what I mean. So I think we have been there. Yeah, that's part of where we've been before. So let's jump down here. To the ornate wooden area. And there's the top of the thing. Very cool level design. I'm a fan of this whole cathedral. This might be the coolest general layout yet. Hello. Hello there, you, you light sp spamming worm fuck. Uh, kill one quick, because there's two on me. There's more than two. Is it a one-shot kill? There are a one-shot kill. Nice and easy. Nice and easy, you wormy fuckheads. Oof. God, we've got, like, man maggots. Man, man, mots, man, mots. Fucking ugly shits. We're gonna leave now. This will raise 
Big ol' gate number two, but what the fuck's the point? At least I can walk through them. I assume I can do the... Just like with that one, it will let me walk through it and just not the giants. Yeah. So I can traverse no matter what, but your giants can't follow me. That's w oh, right, this, this one's letting you cross, I see. That's good. Okay. Well, both giants wouldn't follow me far before they gave up on me. Like, this one gave up before I even reached the fucking edge of that... that curved edge down there, so it w it's not like they would have followed me through this open area anyway. So I'm feeling like it's not... to block the giant's path... pathing at all. But some other reason... Uh, Alright, before we cross or do anything, is there anything else here? No. Let's go around this side first. Can I get a fucking bonfire? Uh, the the caster ones are stronger. They're a they're a two hit kill. Fuck off! Look at them all, you maggoty shits! Back off there! Back off! Even weak man maggots can still overwhelm you if there's too many of them. Yes. Look at them all. <laughs> what a heap of sorry shit. Some of these have got fucking shit impaling them. Somebody's been around here impaling these poor man maggots. Hello, door. Friendly one? I mean, some. Right. Weird shit happening. Look at his face. Hello. But again, he's not like... That's the second mob in the cathedral who ain't attacking me. Hm. What the hell is gonna happen next? Bonfire! Why is that moving? Oh god. Alright, please don't, like, nothing attack me or go wrong, just, just, just chill. Everyone relax and chill, please. What's this one called? Let's re- let's- fuck, I've got all those fuckers behind me now alive again. Rosaria's bedchamber. Oh, we got a moving th slug. That must be Rosaria, let's loot this shit. Is this a boss or an NPC? Helm of... Ah, oh, that must be, uh... It's not Littlefinger, it's not Yellowfinger. Fuck me, what's his name? The 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 invader fuckhead. It must be his armor set. Which I'm not gonna wear. I don't wanna be thorny. There, that's his name. Something Kirk. The Notorious Knight of Thorns. A fitting item for the murderous Kirk. For even a simple act of rolling can damage enemies. Dude, that is a spiky thing. Let's check the vicinity before we speak to Queen of the Slugs. Can you can you stop getting your little slug boys to like try and eat me? Talk, hello there. Let's eye her up, shall we? Let's give her a proper looking up and down. She's got a human face and chest, and hands. Hey. Not a bad, not a bad half to be human, but your, your bottom half ain't quite as, uh, quaint, let's just say. All right, okay. Rosaria, nice to meet you, if this is you. Hey, I, I've just noticed it is a literal bed. It's like a, a four-poster bed or whatever you call it. Hope you don't mind me speaking to you in the privacy of your bed. Join Covenant. Well, I mean... You know... Nah. I, I, I do want, like, talking and, and stuff. Can I... Oh shit, I can't talk to her anymore. Hang on now, hang on. I might say yes, because I want to, like, talk to her and get dialogue and shit. Sorry, wolf boys. 
Hang on, Rosaria's fingers join her covenant. You have obtained proof of the covenant. Oh, your pale tongues! Ultra? What? Say what? Reallocate attributes, ultra. P right, I'm gonna join every covenant from now on, because you get shit like this. Fucking. Ultra appearance. My my appearance is beautiful and perfect, but I just want to see what it says. The price of rebirth is paid in pale tongues. Rebirth can be performed five more times during this lifetime. No, so I can look different, or I can respec. Not that I would. I've got a perfect thing. Oh, hang on. So rebirth. Right. You've got two different menu options here, but that sounded like the same fucking thing. Do you see what I mean? Like, like once you do Rebirth, you get to do both of these at the same time. But it is odd they have two different options. Well, I'm not going to do either of those at all in this playthrough. I look perfect. I look hot AF. And my stats are perfect for what I need, so... I'm just going to give my Pale Tongues rather than save them. I'll at least give her one because that I think the first item is always a level up in the in the covenant system. There you go. I mean, can you say anything, please? <laughs> no. Right, I'll I'll save the rest. Um Oh! Hello over there. Again, I'm not asked about the covenants really, but it looks like jo joining them in this game does. It works a bit different than the previous games, because I'm still wearing whatever covenant item I choose to wear. So it looks like you can join all of them and just choose which one you represent in a given moment, rather than you can only be assigned to one of them. Right, who the fuck are you? Hang on, is this the red eye guy that was sitting in uh, Firelink? Ah. It is. So, you've chosen to serve Rosaria after all? He did mention Rosaria. She will be pleased with me for finding her another finger. <laughs> ah! But be warned, my friend. I see. Rosaria's fingers need only fetch tongues for their mistress. Otherwise, we are free. Unchained. Mm. Like Yellowfinger, you can choose to believe that all fingers share camaraderie. Hazel. But do not force your romance upon the rest of us. Right. Okay. okay. So I get the the knee, the. I get the finger in the name. So any anyone that's got finger in the name is part of this covenant. I wonder if some of the finger invaders would be friendly then. He just straight up said Yellowfinger Hazel uniquely has this idea of camaraderie. But he said you need not, blah, 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 blah. I wonder if Yellowfinger Hazel would be friendly. But other fingers like Kirk, who apparently is a murderous piece of shit, wouldn't be friendly. Rosaria's fingers need only fetch to otherwise you are free to Okay, die. well, okay. Other you are well, that is the most PvP-sounding covenant yet. Uh, so I'm going to stick with you wolfie boys. It's a shame she doesn't have any uh, dialogue, though. I mean, I might as well give the fucking pale things. I don't need them for respecking or anything. Although, you know, there's no point really. It'll just deepen the covenant bond. But you'll need more than the two that I've got for the next level. Okay. That was one of the items I gave to the crows. Maybe I can give more. All right, get out of my way. Fuck. Hang on. Fucking die. Oh my god. Stop hitting shit, man. Right. Is this one still friendly? I mean, I'm part of your covenant now. Why have you got all your ma maggots fucking attacking me? It ain't cool. I guess this one over here is officially... Hang on now. Is officially like uh maybe this is the Rosaria's son, so he's a friendly one. Cause uh Yeah. He doesn't want to fight. Interesting. Right, let's cross the bridge, let's just keep going. I mean interesting. Oh 
I was thinking there might be more to that, but uh, yeah. Let's go. What if you can kill Rosario? <laughs> if you're a mean bastard. You know, maybe it's an optional boss or something. Jewel charm. Now, where does this go? That's the question. Right. Oh, it is where I thought it was. It is the shortcut. I must be getting my heights of this place all wrong, because I thought this was way further, like, down, you know? Guess not. Shortcut opened. Although, is it a shortcut, really? I mean, what what's connected to this? Like, just... I suppose if I die, the chapel bonfire, you go up that lift now that that shortcut is opened. And now this one is opened. It's like a double shortcut getting back to here. I reckon there's a boss room pretty fucking... Uh... Pretty soon. Okay. Hang on. Right! This must be step three of the, the triple shortcut back from the chapel, then. All right. Okay, did I do everything in, like, a weird, f f fucked up order? I feel like I should have come here, like, from the elevator, and then we would have gone across here. Right. So I jumped down prematurely onto the, uh, onto the platform over there. All right. Okay. Well, let's get back down and, uh, yeah. So rooftop is is closely connected to this little shit. Um, what's the fastest way down without dying? It, I can't get anywhere now because I jumped down from there, so... Actually, I think I've got to go through this door I opened. Fine with me. Let's do the maths and figure out how the fuck... Uh, like, this is at the... I can't get onto that thing with the elevator that'll go back to the chapel, can I? Not easily. So... But then back down that thing there, that ladder there, just goes to there, which is a drop down from the chapel. There's no fast way back from anywhere here. I'm gonna fucking use a bone. <laughs> like a fucking... Like a lazy bastard. <laughs> I can see the shortcuts, but the, the, they were all dropping down, so I couldn't go backwards from this. Oh. Right, I forgot there was a bonfire here. <laughs> okay. Well, we'll just travel to the chapel bonfire instead. Hmm. And let's confront the giants and, uh, and maybe try and open that door that's behind the... Uh, the one of the giants. It's a bit of a mindfuck, this, the layout of this cathedral, but I do appreciate it. Dude, I've been going two hours, 14 minutes, and most of that has been me being confused and lost. I'd really like a boss fight in this episode. So let's properly confront the giants and, uh, and see what the deal is. Right, this, this is the uh, the drop down you can't get from that door I opened. To here. Right, anyway, so... Um, th hang on, hang on, sorry. This out there, up there, goes to the rafters and you can drop down from the rafters onto the platform where the bridge... I don't want to be here, do I? I want to be... It's the other fucking way out of the chapel. <laughs> Until I get that other elevator inside the main chapel shortcut unlocked, then coming back this way is pointless and irrelevant. Let's get back in this main room and then whatever's following me still, I'll fight and kill. 
Right. You can undo the, the raising and lowering of this shit as well. So I can send the gate back up if I need to. Oh, damn. But I don't think that will do anything. Um, hang on. I've already forgotten where the fuck this was going. This unlocked this, which goes to the shortcut back to the ch chapel. Hang on. Hang on. It I was wrong. What, the f what is wrong with? What is wrong with me once again? I went on the elevator to, to, to shortcut. Forgot it was like a double shortcut. It doubled up as a shortcut back into the room that I meant to go in for fuck's sake. And also back to the crystal lizard. It's like a triple shortcut. You live and you learn. So I've got I've got a shortcut to all levels of this place now. It's all opened up, with the exception of the end of this place, up the elevator to the middle of it. So I've got a shortcut back to the to the main floor of the cathedral. I've got a shortcut to the roof, and I've got a shortcut to the middle level outside of the place. Shortcuts for these. Now, let's just check this place out and do everything. We've got a. No is this another? It is. We've got more shit. Right. Okay. And I'm guessing there's another one. So we've probably got two more things to raise. And I bet this is one of them. Rise! Rise, riders of Theoden! Shields shall be splintered! A sword day, a red day, ere the sun rises! Death! Etc. Riders of Rohirrim? Right, okay, enough grab assin. Uh, is the other one behind him? No, but there is a thing to do. Right. While I don't have pr I want to open the door. I've got a feeling we're going to flood this place with water or something big is going to happen. Uh, I can go up there behind him. And that looks bossy to me. Or I can risk death. I can risk life and limb and try and loot the stuff and open the door before he kills my ass. Um, and it, oh, God, hang on. Are these guys going to... Let's try and get away from it. I don't want them to follow me in the shit or I am fucking dead. Let's just get the loot one time. As always, I'm probably doing shit backwards here. Right, go for it. Just, just roll for days and get the loot. That's all that matters in life is that I've got the loot. Maiden. Oh, whoa. Right, heal quickly because he's too slow to get a follow-up attack. There you go, he's too slow. This guy's too slow. Right, I'm going to get him to attack me on purpose here. On purpose. Attack me, please. He, right, attack. Right, okay. Yeah. <laughs> just, just push, 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 deliver the baby. Oh my good Jesus. Oh. Well, it worked. Are you not expected to come here? Okay, 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 okay. So, just a, ba just a, just a basic soul. Nothing to fear from a basic soul. Well, I mean, surely that's not not supposed to happen. It was a bit of a bullshit way to get through the door. Let's see what happens when we open this door, but I think I might be going back again. In true fluffy fashion, I think I've done the wrong thing first. <laughs> Unless it's just simply a shortcut. Saint Biden. Saint Biden. Okay, maybe it is a dead end. It's just loot. You know what? My my voice is parched, so I'm gonna quickly quickly visit the men's room and relieve myself of urine. 
And then we'll read Saint Bident and go back up and try and kill the giant's foot. So, I'll jump cut for you guys. And we're back again. You know what always helps in the face of horror and, uh... Something that helps you not be afraid of giants and wormy monsters and other ugly things and spider dogs and fucking... <sighs> Pink lemonade. It is liquid courage outside of being alcoholic. Okay. Well, if you mix some gin with this, let me tell you. Now that is some fucking liquid courage. <laughs> let me know in the comments if you want to see one unique drunken episode of Dark Souls 3. Hey. Hey now. You might think I, w I would be off my A game. I've gotten drunk and played, played some like, you know, some some multiplayer games before and it makes me better. I'm, I'm just warning you. <laughs> I am good. I'm a functional alcoholic. Now what the fuck is Saint Bident? Can I get me a Saint Bident? Is it is like a key I need? There it is. It looks fucking amazing, like a twin a twin blade sort of a thing. Spear thrust. It's uh faith, strength, and dex for, uh scaling. Only physical damage. A silver Biden decorated by a holy symbol formerly wielded by Saint Klimt. He discarded this weapon that drew that draws upon one's faith on the day that he put his own faith behind him. Right, okay. Alright. That's the coolest looking spear we've seen so far. Um All these angels are covering their face. Hmm. Is this truly a dead end then? I guess so, unless that was a... No, that's not a, a place you can go. Right, let's confront the giant's feet. It did kind of come close to the platform, so I wonder if I can kill the fuck, or at least hit his feet, um, without getting in the shit. I mean, I thought it, that was his face. He's, he just face smashed me. Are you kidding me? I thought I dodged that perfectly. Right, hang on now, hang on now. No, no, I need you to, to, to lower your shit. Lower your shit, please. I mean, I just... I can't tell if he's got health. Oh, he does! Whoa, hey now, hey now. Oh, for fuck's sake, man. I kind of, I mean, I won't lie to you. He really is headbutting me. I kind of want to complete this place before killing these two guys. Now I know I can kill him. I mean, he's got a health bar and it's not great. Um, but I feel like the raising of the doors, etc. Since there's like four doors. I've got a feeling there's some greater reason behind it. And it might be something to do with the giants. I can always return and kill the giants later, you know what I mean? Uh, yeah. It, it might even turn out that it's required, because they might have some keys or something I need, but until then... Until then... Uh, let's get the fuck out of Dodge, right. Give me stamina, 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 stamina. Nice and stamina. Lots of stamina, all the stamina. He's too slow. Even versus... <laughs> that might make a good th a good thumbnail right there. <laughs> oh. Fucking hell. Right, okay. The gate is actually stopping him now. Isn't it? Or is he gonna like smash it down or some shit? Oh, is he gonna like... Oh, is he... Right, I figured he'd like lose interest or whatever, but it literally now... Let's get line of sight and so he fucks off. Well, there's proof in the pudding right there. The gate is literally blocking them, so these are like safety gates. 
Ah, let's get behind the... Let's get all the loot and then get behind this one so we can go up. Oh no, hey now, hey now. Okay, right, um, I mean, all oh, right, oh my god, hang on, back off now, back off. Now I've got the little sludges after me, I need to kill them. Right, there we go, there we go. He, he can fuck off, but I need the sludge boys. The, the imminent d danger of the giant, enough. It is enough, like, risk and danger. I can't be having these fucking spiky sludge come after me. I need to remember to beep that word out. Why did I say that word? <laughs> that was not a good family-friendly word to use. Never called something a, a spiky sludge before in my life. That's a first. Right, die, would you? Bloody hell, man. What are these sludge? This mega sludge toxic can, uh, can... <laughs> can drop anything useful. Right, I'm going to stop and start my recording because it's, an, it's a nice break, nice little place to make sure there's no file corruption and also it'll remind me to bleep out the words I just said. Right, here we are. I shall not use any unfamily friendly words. Um, let's go. Oh, there's, there's still a couple more sludges, but you know what? Sometimes in life you've got to risk being spiked by a sludge. Right, heal fast, because these guys are so slow that you can, you can. Fucking hell, man. That you can heal before. At least he's hurting those things. Move! Right, fucking hell. Oh. Perfect, perfect fucking timing on the shit there. Sometimes in life you've got to be perfect, and this is one of those times. I, I saw the item down there, don't you worry. Don't you fucking worry, I'm just getting to safety first. Jesus Christ. Fuck off, would you? Go back to sleep. I don't want what you're selling. It's like a like a pesky fucking salesman at your door. Just just fuck off. He's gone to sleep in a different position just to piss me off more. I want that item. Um, right, we're full health. Oh shit! Oh fuck no! Oh for fuck's sake! Not anymore. We're not. Jesus. Oh for fuck's sake! He's awake again. He's awake again. He's back to sell me some more shit. No, I don't want to buy a vacuum cleaner or some sort of fucking car insurance. Fuck off. Right. Okay. I need to start power attacking anytime there's walls on either side of me because of Jesus. I think he's literally now actually blocking my way. Can you stand up? Yeah, his feet are blocking my way. Fuck off, man. This better be worth it. Drang, alright. I've got, I've got the full Drang set, which is interesting. I mean... Right, heal, 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 heal! Fucking shit. Is anything over there? What's that over there? Fuck 
off. I think I got everything. I got the full Drang set, including the weapons. Let's read the Drang set. Good Jesus. Drang. What the fuck is Drang? I thought I got a full Drang set. Did I not get a helm? Huh. Drang Lake? Armor of the Drang Knights. Uh, as in Drang Lake from the second game. Proclaim descendants from the land known for the legend of the linking of the fire. That must be named for Drang Lake. Which is odd, because that's the second game, and thus at least, at minimum, the third place and time the fire is linked. Because it was Lord Ran in the first game. Fine protection, but light and strong. Reinforced with rare guy steel. The Drang Knights were once feared cell swords until treason meant descending into the abyss and they were separated forever. Okay. Um, lighter than one I've got. Shit poise? Nah. That's just a piece of shit. Well, let's read the um, weapons specifically. Drang, 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 drang. Do a drang, do a drang, 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 double hammers, hey. Paired hammers of the Drang Knights, descendants from the land known for the legend of the Ling of the Fire. When the Drang Knights disbanded, they scattered across the lands as cell swords. They quickly became known for shieldless, aggressive tactics. Into the hearts of men. Well, not this man. Although, honestly, if I see, like, a Drang Lake Knight coming out and me swinging a couple of hammers, I might shit pants and just run. But until then, I'll keep the shit inside my pants. You know what I mean. <laughs> oh, it's, these are carbon copies of the, the friendly one in the bell tower. Uh, right, well, fuck. Let's just... I want to get that big knight on me. Uh, I've got no flasks left, so Jesus, we've got to we've got to get to a fire or do something soon. Okay. Little concerned. Is this guy got you? You missed. Any follow-up attacks? You missed. <laughs> nice sword, though. Fucking hell. Cathedral... Ah! Cathedral Knight Helm. So these are unique to the cathedral, then. Hmm. That looks like the, the helm that the guy wears in one of the uh, League of Extraordinary... Gen no, the fucking... Uh, old British comedy. I can't remember what the fuck it is. Uh... The guy that says, "'Tis but a flesh wound," uh, when, when he gets his arms and legs and shit cut off. I can't remember what it's called. Uh, Monty Python is one of the Monty Pythons. But it, it, the helm looks exactly the same as that guy's helm. Right. Now the guys will leave me alone. Cathedral of the Deep. Repulsive creatures of the Deep are sure to attract the foolish, but the Cathedral Knights are prepared... <laughs> To meet such intruders head on the okay, right, okay. Cathedral Knights then. Well, this one's sleeping, I'm not gonna wake him up. Let's just loot everything and do everything. Ember. Now if my geography is to be believed, there should be a elevated shortcut through here to the left, so let's do that. Cause something's about to happen. <laughs> and I want shortcut at the ready. For just such an occasion. Oh. Well, I know that I'm right. It is in this direction. Was it out here to the right? Or was it... Have I not gone far enough yet? Now, here it is. Okay, let's do it. And there we go. So, just for my own fucking geography and recollection, etc. So I know going forward. The way back here, should I die, which is likely, um, it's, in fact, um, 
Right, I've got enough souls to level up, so what we're gonna do... We're gonna test my shortcut theory to get back here. But first we need to get the fuck back, so let's go to the Rosaria bonfire. I need to... I need to breathe. I'm always tense playing these games. I think that's why I tend to lose my voice at like the two hour mark. I'm just, I'm constantly like shitting pants and fucking... And that translates to my throat and my voice. That fuck has gone. Whatever his name is. He's vanished. I wonder if he'll be back in Firelink. Travel. Mm. Right, come on now. I can sense Cathedral Boss. Not counting the, uh, the big giants. I'm gonna just leave there. <gasps> She's back again! Saris, or Iris. Whatever her name is. Mm. I see that you are now a finger of Rosaria. I mean, I don't want to be, really. Your path is wholly different to mine. No! Gentle unkindled. No! I bid you farewell. Oh, have I just, like, fucked her? If we meet again... Oh, God. It will be as adversaries. Right. Okay. I think I'm Gentle ballsed. <laughs> Have I officially ended a potential quest line there? <laughs> Shit. Well, you know, it, it seems very useful being part of Rosaria's people, but I'm I'm not. I'm I'm part of the Wolf Boys. Before we level up, even I'm just gonna very quickly go back to Wolf Statue. Do do, do you have to officially re-pledge to it? Because I thought equipping the item would be enough to like uh, to not be in the Rosaria Covenant, but be in the Wolf one. But I guess not. No, no, I am still in the Covenant. Okay. All right. Well, you know, it is what it is. Damn. I wonder what you could have done with the. Uh, Sarah, or whatever her name was. Was her name Cirrus? I know it was like Sarah and like Iris. Saris? Right. Welcome, host. Level up. Very well. Then tuck Haken. Eh, I need a little bit more, but I should have enough souls. I wish I had a I've lost my voice, man. <laughs> I can't sing beautifully anymore. Welcome, host. Well, level up. Then take them. Faith ride eighteen. We're getting up there. Farewell, Ashen Maiden. Thanking you. Let's get back. Uh, I mean, I mean, literally, actually, what the fuck am I talking about? Because her fire is just over the bridge from there, so... So what the fuck am I talking about? In fact, what's the point of that shortcut when you have her bonfire? I'll do it just one time. Um, a lot of the short... I, I appreciate a shortcut as much as the next man. But uh, some of them do seem a little superfluous sometimes. It's... Right, so up there... Sorry. Up there, you can jump down, go through the main doorway that goes to... To where I need to get to, to get on the elevator that I just unlocked. Through there is the ground, flo ground floor where the giants are. Gotcha. Um, yeah. Understood. But yeah, some of the shortcuts do seem a bit superfluous. Like, once you've opened them up, it's like you'll never, ever use that shortcut. Not for all of them, just just some of them. Like this one. I'm running back through this door I've opened to get to the elevator, but... But having got the Rosaria bedchamber fire, this run back is kind of irrelevant. Because you just get that fire, just run across the bridge to get back here again. The only argument against that would be if for some reason I ha I was required to lower these gates that I've risen, because then I'd lose access from that fire, and then you would need this shortcut. You see what I'm saying? But, yeah. 
I still appreciate a shortcut. Now let's just... I'm gonna try and ignore them best I can here. I'll kill this one again because he's right fucking here. Come at me. Oh, these guys, these guys move fast when they want to. Dropping anything? No. They definitely, there's no way you can't get their sword. Kill them all, and then we can just confront the two praying at the thing and... Ugh. Oh, this is some boss arena looking shit. Dude. Hello. Well, I'm not gonna just piss him off for no reason. Hmm. I mean, there's gotta be a fucking boss suit. Ain't no way I've come all this way to not kill the, like, king of all... Oh, there we go. That's a boss fault. Okay. Horace the Hushed. Bit like a gimp look to him. <laughs> I'd rather not summon a gimp to help me in this fight. Oh. Oh, hang on. There was a fucking item. Hold the phone. Deacon Robe. Well, we'll fight the giant's after this fight, let's just go down to seven flasks. And we're good to go. Hold on, hang on. Dead end. Yeah. This is reminding me of the cathedral in the, uh, in Anor Londo. In the first game. How there's like... There's area behind the cathedral, like, it's almost like this open area is where you fight Ornstein and Smo, or Smau, whatever his name is. Oh, there's another one. That was hard to see. Anri of Astora. Right. Okay, I'm guessing quest line here. But this is going to be a, ma a major boss, I know it is. Mm. I, I, I do like the quest lines, but... I did lose something in the second game by summoning Lucatiel for a bunch of major bosses. Uh, I care about Onion Boy. I, but I think I'm not going to summon Anri. I just want to kind of do the, the bosses on my own, at least first time. But I, I'm aware that this will fuck up any potential quest line. It is what it is, you know what I mean. Deacons of the Deep. Okay. Okay. Alright, alright. So we got a bunch of little bastards. This is... I don't know if this is main boss of Cathedral, but... Fuck it. Oh, you've got a, You've got some big round boys. In and amongst the, the smaller... Thin boys. Hmm. You know what would... You know what's gonna work fucking great in here? Force. I, th I don't know if it does damage, though. This is a nice big arena. I approve. I wonder if uh, killing these things is going to do something to the... Are those people up, up there? No. Right, okay. Let's, uh, let's see what they can do when you get near them. They can put red shit on the floor. Okay, right, back off now, back off now. That force thing, they've got to get close for that. <laughs> Fuck! Whee! Oh, you've got to be really, really close for that force to do anything. But it was still funny to do. <laughs> Ooh, right, I need to... Let's get them to the corner. 
where only a f I can let a couple come round the corner and attack those, so they're not all having a go at the same time. Well, let's do a power attack as well, because that will go... Yeah, that'll go straight down, and then I'm safe from all the fireballing fuckers. In fact, I'm safe for quite a while doing this. Just keep coming to the corner. Bring your pretty face to my corner, bitches. Yeah. <laughs> right, they've, they've overwhelmed the corner. They All right, I'm, I've just realized I'm not doing any damage here. Let's uh, get them to the corner again, though. Once they start spreading out, then I need to... I need to go to the next corner along, if you see what I mean. Right, next corner, next corner. They've overwhelmed the corner. But what's the deal? I'm not doing any damage. Right, I've killed a couple. I've killed a big one and a small one. Not doing shit. Do I have to kill, like, ones that are glowing red, maybe? Let's kill this one. Get out of here. Because some of them are glowing red. You see that fucker there? Let's try killing that one. It is! Yes! Right, let's kill the, the red ones. Oh! Okay, oh, okay. Any of them can glow red. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Let's kill a couple just to get them out of my fucking way. He seems tall, that one. That's a different one. I need them to group... Oh, they're all spread out. I need them to, group, to gang up together. I want to be able to fall back on a corner, if you see what I'm saying. Oh! <laughs> oh my god. Oh, they're transferring the red shit between them. Ah, oh, fuck off. Right, okay, you've got small weak ones, fat tough ones, and then tall ones. Which are weak, but I reckon they could do more damage. Come to me. Come to my corner. As long as I, I've figured out the secret, I just need to... I need to group them all together and only attack the red boy. Ah! When the red one gives up his redness, it goes up in the sky and lands on another one. So, when it happens, watch, and I can see who's about to turn red. I might even be able to preemptively get a, a swing on the red boy before he turns red. Right, the re I need the red one to be on the outside of the group. Oh, he's transferred the redness. Fuck. <laughs> right, it's the tall boy. Oh, I... Mm. Oh, you've got to find your moments in this fight. Hmm. I need the, p the pillar stop the fireball. So you know what? Fuck the corner of the central thing. Let's use the pillars instead. Because it, it makes me so much safer from the fireballs. <laughs> Red. Uh. Other than the fireballs, the main thing to watch out for here, I reckon, is... Um, is the round roly... The roly-poly fat ones, because they have a, a lunge attack. Back off now, back off now. I, I d oh, did I not hit the red boy? I thought I did. Oh, hang on. Oh, for fuck's sake, the red one is right in the middle. Oh, they don't like... They really don't give a fuck. You can just attack and just sit there. They don't give a single fuck. Kill that one. He's got low health. And you too. You too. You too. Oh my god. Right. Okay, these are basic bitches. Red boy. I'm just gonna just... Oh, fuck it. Front and center. Who needs pillars or corners? Just fucking go for it. Who's red now? It's fine. Just fucking take some hits. Don't matter. There's no way this is gonna not have a phase two. These... Heal. I don't like that sound. 
Right, okay, phase two. Was that this guy making that sound? Oh! Curse build up, fuck it hell. Oh, hang on now, there's a blue boy. I can see blue boys. The, the, the blue round boys. Um, oh shit. Is it just killing them I get curse build up? Or did he hit me with an attack? Oh fuck, I got hit with an attack, didn't I? Uh, <laughs> fucking Jesus! Right. Okay, let's okay, let's let the curse go down and just chill for a sec. Can any of them do curse attacks, or is it just the blue boys? And where are they going? Come back here. Let's kill the stragglers, so I've got some room to breathe. Curse shit can't hit me. Look at it, it's, go it's going up in the sky. What's it doing? Does it just disappear? Right, okay. Curse can't hit me if I'm stood behind the thing. Okay, right, let's kill- Oh, dig <gasps> Okay, that, that went through the shit, didn't it? Right, I'm just gonna go for it now, because it can go through the shit. Right, let's, uh, hang on. Hang on, are they like- uh Get some stamina, get some stamina. Is that... Um... Do I have to go near the fire? Or something? It's going up, it's going up, can I go near the fire for, for, for respite or something? I don't know what's going on! I'm gonna die! I'm gonna get cursed! I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just, I'm cursed, that's it. Is that auto dead then? Just life over. Well, what in the fuck? The entire motherfucker was, 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 was misted and cursified. I c there was no getting away from it. If one is in a cloud with walls on all sides, how is one supposed to not be swallowing cloud? Now, I got cursed. Now, as with right, the first game, when you get cursed like that, you also die on the spot instantly. Now, has it done anything to me? Nope, I'm not hollowed. I've lost the ember, but who gives a fuck? Health hasn't, uh... Has the... has... Hmm. Let's just, let's just go for it, but I don't know if the curse has, in fact, done anything or not. You know what, I want to see which is faster. Let's try running back from the other bonfire. Oh, so they've got multiple phases. I should have known it was the, the red boy phase was far too easy. So phase two is is purple cursed blue boys, and that was on about half health. So I don't think there'll be a phase three. But it's easy enough. I'm just gonna go for the blue boys. The 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 ones in blue robes. I reckon they'll take damage. Whew. I've got less health now though. I think I've got just enough to take one big curse blast to the face. If I'm on full health when I take the, the curse blast. Uh, let me just take a quick look at armor and shit because... You know, I, I'm only taking fire and curse, so I've only, have I got any lighter curse shit. Oh, some of this is way better for curse. The maiden shit was down in the sludge with the giant, and I think I got the antiquated, antiquated stuff from in the just before the boss. Did I not in that room with the two knights? That's got eighty six curse and high fire, very high fire. Let's look at the pyromancer for rel for like comparison with fire. Uh, that's thirteen. It's right. So that antiquated, antiquated shit is better for fire, even than the pyromancy set, and even better for curse. Let's see if there's anything higher with curse. 86, 17. Right, I think we know what we're wearing for this fight. It's the next highest. 71, 74. 
know what, Pyromance is really good for this. Fire and curse. 75, 79. You know, the Maiden stuff is actually pretty good as well. White robe. Ro robe? Robe worn by traveling maidens. Part of their formless attire regardless of rank. Let's read everything here. Dress sewn in a long lost fashion. The elaborately embroidered ivory silk. Right, okay. Um. Well. I think I got a full antiquated set, did I not? Yep. 29. Yeah, it is it is the curse set. Oh, I get to wear a skirt. Anyone can wear anything, but uh, just in terms of, l let's say, traditional gender roles, shall we say. It is appropriate that I'm a lady and I get to wear this dress now. You know? Wearing this as a male character might be a little weird. <laughs> Again, not you know, I'm, I'm not saying nothing, I'm just saying. It is the highest, isn't it? Yeah. Right, well, hey, I get to be a beautiful lady in a dress. Oh, did I not get an antiquated headpiece? I didn't. That's, that's just... I can imagine, like, a fancy... Uh, one of the posh, rich people on the Titanic wearing this. You know, one of those arsehole, posh women. <laughs> but I didn't get a, a headpiece. I guess an antiquated lady might not wear something on her head, but that's weird that I didn't get a headpiece for it. What's good for curse? 1920... Yeah, fuck it out. Luke Teal's mask is actually pretty fucking good for curse. 24. Um, Sorcerer. Xanthius. 26, 29. Cleric. 31. Right, 31 is the highest. And that fits the dress, kinda. In terms of aesthetic, 27. Yeah, let's put that on. You know, it's officially not part of that set. But fucking hell, it it could easily be. It looks exactly like it suits the dress. Hey, <laughs> needs must, and that is indeed a better fire to run back to this boss. So I've got better fire protection now. Speaking of, uh, real quick, the ring situation. I don't need poison, but I've got fire defense. I just don't have any curse defense. No. Right, so I've got I've got much, much, much better curse resist now. Like orders of magnitude more curse resist, and I've got a little bit more fire resist. I've got less health though. Let's do this. I'm back with a vengeance and with the dress, motherfuckers. I'ma dress you bitches up. Let's kill the red boys nice and fast. I'm not going to take no prisoners. Let's get around the fuckers. Oh, he's in the... He's right in the fucking center of the pack. Seriously? Oh! Oh! <laughs> I love hitting, like, all of these guys at the same time. Right, red. Where's the red ball going? Ah, oh, so it's just whichever is nearest to where the red ball lands. It's flying up there. Fuck you. <laughs> nice and easy. Nice and easy. Next on the list. Oh, there is still red. It's blue, boys. All right, stamina back, stamina right. I'm just gonna go for the. I'm gonna, I'm gonna fucking go for this. I'm gonna fucking go for this. Red, red can keep dying. Red can keep dying. Hit 
before I get cursed, before I get cursed, heal to full, double heal, it doesn't matter. And then I'm gonna run straight back to the red bastard. Heal to full, heal to full. Small doll souls of the dick of the deep. Defeat the dick of the deep. <sighs> That's a dark, evil looking blue soul right there. Let's read that doll. Doll. D doll. Right, it's a key item. Ooh, that's interesting. Silverwork doll depicting a young squire. Podrick Payne? In the legendary old city of Arithal. That's the cold boy land where the big dog fuck came from. Vort. Oh no, that's Borea. Uh, that's the Boreal Valley. Sorry, I missed that. I completely got the wrong end of that stick. So. In the legendary old city of Erythil, situated in the Bore Ah, that's it, sorry. Yeah, no, I am right, fuck. I should have more confidence in myself. In the Boreal Valley, the Pontiff Sullivan, that's a name we recognize, gave this doll to valued subjects so that they might use it to cross the ba Ah, I bet I can use this to get to the Boreal Valley. Hmm. Listen carefully. And you can hear it say, wherever you go, the moon still sets in Erythal. Wherever you may be, Erythal is your home. Caesar is home. Okay. Well, that definitely sounds to me, to me like we are going to use this key item to get to Erythal. And or the Boreal Valley. I'm glad I succeeded because I forgot to pick up my fucking souls. Right, well, where the fuck would I use this key? I can't think of anywhere, uh... What, what's this one called? I can't think of a door or anywhere we haven't been yet, not counting the catacombs of your... whatever you call it. Right. I'm taking the order of these bonfires and the tabs of bonfires and with like a grain of salt. But if this leads me to think anything, it's that I went to Rosaria's chamber early, because it's after the Deacons of the Deep one. You know what I mean? And it's like, you know, the elevator that goes up and over to her is almost like it's after this boss fight. Oh well. Ooh! Archdeacon! I did think the final fucker that I was hitting was taking a lot of hits. This must have been a unique part of the boss fight then. The Archdeacon. White crown, holy garb, and skirt. No boots though. I'm getting a distinct lack of incomplete sets this episode. I didn't get a headpiece for my fucking antiquated shit, and I didn't get some boots for the Archdeacon. What gives? White crown worn by an archdeacon of the cathedral that he presented solely to dele delegates of the gods. One of the three archdeacons of the deep one cast off his white crown and left the Ah, hang on. One cast off his white crown and left the cathedral to stand by Aldrich. Was that this one? Because this guy isn't isn't standing by Aldrich. Aldrich is nowhere to be seen. But I guess we've got two more deacon fights. Oh, this is boots. Sorry, I am. I'm getting the shit mixed. Skirt worn by archdeacon. Okay. Oh, hang on. They've all got different fucking descriptions. Of the archdeacons of the deep, one attended to Rosaria, mother of rebirth, whom he deemed a goddess. So somebody deemed that worm woman. A goddess, okay, understood. Let's read the next one. Holy God. Let me know in the comments if I should be reading the description of every item of a set. Because this is the first time there's been actual unique shit on every piece of the set. I usually only read, like, the headpiece or the chest piece. But these have all got interesting shit. And of them, one stood over Aldrich's casket with hope that he would return one day. Right, hang on. So we had, so we just killed one of the three that exist. 
And one is standing over Aldrich's casket. It's like, like check mark. Aldrich's casket. Stand by Aldrich. So one's by his casket, one's standing by him personally. And one is attending Rosari, Mother of Rebirth. So that that's odd. I don't know which one this was then. Oh, you know what? I was thinking this, this kind of looks like some sort of mausoleum type massive grave. Is this the casket one? The casket of Aldrich and this was, was his resting place. What's his bonfire called? Is it just Deacons? Yeah. Out of all the, th the descriptions of all three, this one sounds like a, the casket one the most, I guess. So, hang on, is there officially one by Rosaria then? Because she's up there. Unless, uh, what's it look like? The actual armor piece. I'll remember the pointy hat. Because there was one friendly worm person just outside Rosaria's chamber. The friendly worm thing, maybe that was one. All right, right, let's keep going. Interesting. We in Terra Sante, but I haven't seen that pointy hat before. And the uh, the fuckhead by her bedchamber isn't wearing a pointy hat. Hey, well, let's, uh, I, shit. I do love looking like a lady. But I want to look like a fallen knight even more. For now. With Luca Teal's mask. And that's how you do that. Okay. Let's just go back, I guess. Um, I've got the two giants I can kill. But other than that, I think this place is pretty much complete. I can't think of any directions to go or anything remaining. Surprise! We both missed. Don't be embarrassed, sir. I mean, you know. Uh, uh, the You know what? There wasn't a walkway razy thing there. You can easily see where they are, and there isn't one there, but th there is this one. I wonder if that one's got any relevance. There's no getting around the fact that I've risen three gates, and there seems to be not much point in them. It is true to say the giants can't get past them, but so what? What? Like, who cares? You know what I mean? You can just run around the giants anyway. Like, they... so what's the deal? Hmm. Well, what other ways are there to go? We've got the catacombs of the deep. Uh. What other fucking ways are there to go? Catacombs of the Deep? Um, DLC, but that, that really doesn't count. And this is a proper dead end, but I have a key. Uh, I mean, we might go back to filing, do that whole thing. I've been recording for three hours ten, so we're pretty much at the three hour mark, and we're going to call the episode here. But I can't, honest, I mean, we'll try killing a giant right now just because I can. Um, just because I can. I've been embered for free. I've got 20,000 souls, but I reckon I can kill a giant without dying. That's how confident I am. Out of the two giants, this one over here is easier because he hasn't got a thousand sludgy fuckheads with him. Okay. 
Uh, and it's easy enough. I just need to try my best to keep my camera angled upwards. Um, and it's, it's easy enough. I just need to roll at the right time, as you do. And, uh, oh, that's fucking intimidating, man. Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. I still think you might be able to drop a... I still think you might be able to drop a, uh... Between his legs is definitely the way to go here. Definitely the way to go. Come back here. And again, it's just dodging me between his legs. Between his legs, under his gigantic crotch. I mean, up. If this was a Shadow of the Colossus game, I'd be able to jump on that chain and climb him. <laughs> but this ain't Shadow of the Colossus. This is Dark Souls. There you go, giant bitch! Now he's got to have something on him. Got to be something worth my time. Large shard and a dunk bag. Really? I, I like the large shard, but even then, that's not much. I mean, well, let's go kill the other one. If you all tell me in the comments now, these guys can be, like, friendly. Like the big fuck sniper at the top of the tower. I'll be upset. But you know what? They keep trying to kill me, so fuck them. Maybe this, maybe this one will have something. Let's just, uh... God. I'll just try and ignore the, the spiky fucks. Oh, I didn't think he got me right heel, because I, I, I need to be full health for these fucks. There you go. Just keep keep a Fuck off. Spiky fucking things. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. I love the fact more than anything else. That you really do have to go to where their dick was to loot them. Have you noticed that? Crotch loot. Right? I mean, you know, now I've killed them, let's just take a good old look around. There's lots of bodies in the water. Oh, you've got a fucking worm. Maybe under the stairs or something? Fuck off. Right, there's no... There actually is genuinely no uh, gate on this side like there is on that side. Not that I can see. Hmm. But yeah. Um, dude, did each of those... I'm sure I was on 19,000 souls when I killed those two giants. Did I get 5k apiece just then? Or 4k apiece? Not bad. That's worth killing them just for that. Um, uh, let's go back to Firelink, level up, do all that shit, and then I guess we'll do Catacombs of the Deep before anything else. We've got a key to use, but nowhere at all to use it that I can think of. Um, yeah. Let's go. Shit. I could just go back to the boss room <laughs> fire, but hey. Let's go to Rosaria's thing. Let's have a look at the, um, the, the worm that was friendly. See if that's actually a deacon in disguise. I can see it being a thing that the, uh, the deacon that is friendly to Rosaria becomes wormy. Turns into a, wor a wormy deacon. Deacon, is that you? Are you a deacon? Are you, are you a deacon? You don't look like a deacon. 
But you've got the staff that looks like a deacon staff. Oh god, no. Hang on now, no! No! I've been boxed in by worms! Oh my god, no, you have to fuck off! Although, no, this one's got the same staff. Has, uh, isn't it the same staff? Yes, it is. You wormy bastards. Jesus. Get the fuck out of here. Oh my god, I've got a headache. So much worms. Worm action. Oh. Right, okay, so painted world. And yeah, we never did get the first bonfire in the catacombs, but that's fine. Mm. I mean, we haven't got any guidance. This is the first time I don't think we have any guidance as to what to do next. Like, no, no one telling us where to go, you know. Welcome, husband. Ashen one. Okay. Ashen. Yep. Well, let's see if we can get to, uh... Let's see if we can get to 20 faith here and now. I can. Thank fuck. Thank fuck. Uh... Farewell, Ashen one. And before anything, we're gonna throw on lightning in place of force. I like the idea of force. Like, it's like a, a Jedi Force blast, but the problem is, clearly, versus those Deacons, it was revealed that it's it's very, very short range. Like, if they're not right fucking, like, point blank, it doesn't hit them, so... It, it doesn't seem that good. Let's throw lightning on. Fuck yeah! Yeah, okay, let's, uh... I'll, I shall not do it in here, because I'll end up lightning bolting, like, the fire link... Uh, the fire keeper in the face. Weapons and weapons. I don't think anything. anyone's got anything. Oh, actually, now I've cured the shit. I wonder if uh, Yuri has got anything to say to me. I'm back. Are you going to be all pissed off? Now I'm not dark anymore. Thus forsworn the Lord's mark. I did. There is not more to say. Farewell. Oh, she's gonna leave! Oh my god, I'm, I'm, everyone is leaving. That Saris woman that's gone, she's leaving. Does forsworn, don't for I guess she'll just actually disappear now. And poor Yol died for nothing. Right, well, fine. In a future playthrough. Can't please everyone. Yom the Giant of the Profaned Capital. I'm just going to check all the uh, chairs out. Watches of the Abyss. We've got the ash on there from the Abyss fight. Holy King Lothric, last of his hope. Got Ludlith of Corland. Or oh, exiled. And then finally, Aldrich of the... Uh, who the fuck is this? Oh, hang on! It's Gimp Boy. It, it's uh, it's it's bodyguard of Anri. Are they here now? Because I've officially done or, or not done the, the the deacons fight that they were summoned for. Oh, and we meet again. I'm sorry, I killed the boss without but you. Before the road of sacrifices, Anri of Astora. I'm well pleased to see you safe. You too, Anri. We reached the Cathedral of the Deep, but Aldridge's coffin was empty. Mm, that was his casket. Left for his true home. The little doll in the empty coffin told me. I've got that doll. Is said to hail from Irithil in the Boreal Valley, an ancient fabled city. Mm. A pilgrim told me that the city lies beyond Farren Keep, and so becomes our destination. Farren Keep led only to the catacombs of, of the deep. Behind the Abyss Watchers. There was no other place to go. I'm almost fucking certain. You had a swamp area. Lots of places around the swamp, but, but there was nothing else. It was just the thing. Aldridge's honest home is Irithil in the Boreal Valley. Hmm. Fabled city. Okay. A pilgrim told me that the city lies beyond Farrah. Okay, well, that's where we're going for the catacombs anyway. I wonder... I wonder if 
once you get to the end of the catacombs, if there is then a doorway which will then go to the Boreal Valley, and I would need this key from the cathedral to progress at that point. I bet I'm fucking right on the money. I bet if we had gone to the catacombs first, I'd have had to do a U-turn, go back and do the Cathedral of the Deep, and then go back again to the end of the catacombs. Okay, well, that's gonna have to wait till next episode. Um, what else have we got? Like, soul-wise, can I use the Deacon soul for a weapon, maybe? Oh, let's read the, uh, soul. Soul of the Deacons of the Deep. One of the twists. After Aldridge. So let's just do a bit of law, a law sort of working out the law. Aldridge is from the land of. I thought it said, uh, he said that guy just said he came from the Boreal Valley. This says after Aldridge left for the Boreal Valley. I wonder once we get there if Aldridge is in the Boreal Valley. Then he looked like a kraken, slimy big motherfucker, but. Everything else we've seen from the Boreal Valley was cold and frosty. I wonder if he's going to be like a frosty kraken. Archdeacon Royce remained in the cathedral with the high priests to keep eternal watch over the master's coffin. So we did kill the deacon of the casket. It mentioned the other deacon. One deacon was with Rosario. No fucking idea. And then the third one was actually with Aldrich himself. So I'm guessing we're going to find at least one of the two remaining deacons in the Boreal Valley as we go there after the catacombs. But since I've got this... Uh, gimp? Gimp muscle? Anything to say? <coughs> Aldridge's honest home is Irithil in the Boreal Valley. A hey. Right, well. Thanks for the info. At least we've got direction now. Aha, thou returned. So. I did. What are we are here? Um. One. Two. Just those two things. Right, we've got a deep soul. That looks like a dark spell. Sorcery of Archdeacon Royce and his deacons said to have been imparted to them by MacDonald Miller. I thought that was a Metal Gear Solid reference. Um. Of the Boreal Valley. McDonald of the Boreal Valley. Fires. Dr fires dark soul dregs. Right. So it is a dark spell. It fires dark soul shit at the enemy. I, I wonder if that's what the fuckers were doing in the fight. You know, the, the tossing the dark shit at me that killed me. Souls which swell from the deep pursue their target, drawn towards life. And they've just got a candlestick. Candlestick used as both sword and catalyst. Used for worship by the deacons of the deep. So that's what he was holding. The deacons under the guidance of Archdeacon MacDonald became both clergymen and sorcerers. The deacons under the guidance of the... Hang on. Archdeacon MacDonald is another archdeacon. So hang on. Arch Archdeacon Royce... And Archdeacon McDonald. What's the third one called? Okay, well, I'm not interested really in either of those, if I'm completely honest. Um, became both clergymen and sorcerers. I wonder if that means that I can use that for both uh, sorcery and miracles. Uh, it's called a candlestick, but it's a straight sword. The fuck? It's got spell buff on it. And magic damage. Is that like some weird sorcery, sword, and miracle, like, triple combo uh, thing? Huh. Ah, most fine kin and all slain by thy hand. Oh. Mmm. Now, now. <laughs> so, let me just do a number check on the bosses. We've killed the Abyss Watchers. That's throne number one. Sounds like Aldrich on that throne there is next, and he's down in uh, Boreal Valley slash Catacombs. And then we'll just get Yom the Giant later on. Uh, yeah. We, we don't have anything to level, uh, like, level up or anything, do we? I need, I think, two more scales. Hmm. Anyone else to speak to that's, like, particularly pressing? 
Where's Sad Boy? He's probably outside again. Um, I'm trying to think if there's anything left to do this episode before we can end it. Uh, I don't think so. Let me know if I've missed anything like item descriptions to read or if there's anything... Um, I'm certain I've missed something in the Cathedral of the Deep. I must have. I'll be shocked if I've done everything there. I'm a little bit uh, confused at the mention of one of the three deacons being by Rosaria, because, I, I don't know, these archdeacons seem like bosses, and I, I, there was no archdeacon by Rosaria. Um, but I feel like I've missed some, some relevance with the, the gates that go up and down there, like something major, so let me know if I've missed anything. Um... With, with no strong spoilers. You know, you, you guys know what I mean. Just let me know if I missed anything. And if I might want to go back to the cathedral. But otherwise, I think we've completed it. And next time, we're going straight for the catacombs of the dark. Of the... What's it called? Um, Catacombs of Carthus, that's it. Uh, in fact... Where the fuck... Isn't there a fire right in front of it? Now I think about it. Yeah, Abyss Watches. Let's just let's just gaze my eyes on the inside of the entrance. Just so we can see firsthand what we're doing next time. And yeah, I'm guessing that key to the Boreal Valley isn't like used right here. But at the bottom of the catacombs. Hmm. I'm looking forward to next episode, though. Hey. Skeletons. That reminds me, I kind of want to make a blessed weapon just to see if that does anything. Um, well, that's just the cave ceiling, so it's, we're only descending in this place. We've got a big old fucking central staircase. Probably to do with a boss fight, but it'll be a ball lake to get there. Hmm. Well, I'm not... I'm... I was... Oh, I'll tell you what. Last thing in this episode is an awesome thing. Lightning spear. Let's let's cast my first lightning bolt rather than waiting a week before I get to use it. I want to see what the fuck it looks like now. Come here. Bring your pretty face to my lightning bolt. Yeah. Oh. Right. Uh, He's got a shield, which is not a fair representation. Right, okay. Alright, let's see how much uh, blue it uses. That's quite a lot of blue. That's quite a lot of blue for a lightning bolt. I'll, I'll not lie to you. And his shield is throwing off the, the damage, clearly. Not to mention, he might skeletons might be resistant to lightning, for all I know. You know? We know already because of a previous description that lightning is good against armored guys and dragons. So it might simply be the case that uh, I might only want to use lightning against armored uh, and dragons. So that's fine. I'm not going to be I'm not going to be too disheartened of the lack of damage against some shitty skeleton that might be resistant to it. And it's a nice ranged ability. Can I um Actually, binoculars and then do it and like let's say I'm aiming at that giant ball of shit in the distance there that's center of my screen it oh that that looked like it was actually accurate with the binoculars uh, you know what let's test that <laughs> I need to end the episode but hang on you stay right where you are in fact I can just I can properly central my shit here Center of the monitor, right there. Right there. Right, it's got a maximum range, and that's fine with me. I'll say that's about a 20, 15, 20 meter range. Okay. What's it look like, just for my own edification? Just visually. Hang on. It does use a lot of blue. I might need to put points in fucking... Like, more attunement. Jesus Christ, I want to fire at the ceiling. Hang on. Whee! 
Wee! <laughs> oh, by the end of this game, I'm gonna be a lightning tossing son of a bitch. Let me tell you. I do love lightning. Ooh. Right. At rest. Right, there we go. And, uh... Honestly, I'm not even going to go back to filing because I don't think we have much reason to uh, to start the next episode there. We know that Iris, Sarah, whatever her name is, is going to be gone, sadly. That's her quest line fucked. We know that Yuria of Londor now hates me because I, I, I said a big old fuck you to the dark. So her quest line, if that exists, is fucked. Let me know in the comments how many quest lines I fucked in this episode alone. <laughs> and uh, yeah, let me know if I've missed anything that is yet to be fucked, but will be fucked if I keep progressing forwards without going backwards. Like this video if you liked it. Like this video if you didn't like it and subscribe for similar content. All my social media links are in the description. And I have a Patreon if you want to go above and beyond to support my content. That's the number one way to do so and if you want to get early access for the videos and otherwise support the channel games and software and hardware it all comes out of patreon funds so that's what that goes towards but that doesn't go towards anything in my real life other than the channel so yeah best way to support the channel ah uh. Catch you next time for Catacombs of the Motherfucker. Liquid Blitz, out.